We're slowly getting set up here. Hey. All right, we're here for day two. Yep, you can hear me all right? Yep, and I believe let's get our characters up here. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 hey Knuckles. Hey. Here hey, on How's it going? Hey. Knuckles. Oh, how's it going? <laughs> Don't switch up the sign, please. <clears throat> how the master emerald coming along, knuckle? It's going going just fine, as you can see. I have it right here with me, and uh, yes, yes, and yes, indeed. You know, I'm a pretty, pretty, pretty excited. We got a, I got it. We got a little anniversary. For me this year, and uh, and uh, so be turning the uh, the ripe old age of my thirtieth, sixteenth birthday. It's gonna be <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> How you not age is, is a mystery. Don't ask me. Ask Sega. That's our, that's our big question of the weekend. Why do Sonic and friends not age? Absolutely, Central Florida Comic Con. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows. Nobody. I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> so how you doing, buddy? Doing good. You know, staying out, staying out of trouble. Um, avoiding, avoiding, uh, avoiding fights with pigeons over fries. You know, just uh, <laughs> avoiding fighting in general. Um, just yeah. over all good things. All good things. Yeah, just being sure and bad, not taking the mass animal. Did you say what? Avoiding, also avoiding a certain bat shirt, trying to steal the master emerald. Hopefully, she won't show up Oosh. all day. Oosh. Yeah. All right, hang on, just a moment. Oops, not that one. Are you in the room? You're not in the room. You're not in the room. All oh, right, now everybody, I see you. How about Good that job. airline food? Um, <laughs> yeah. How was that airline food? Fantastic. Um, just uh. It was uh, didn't taste at all like an airline, so that's a positive. Um, <laughs> okay, um, tastes pretty close, but ooh, people! Hey, oh, snap! Oh, snap! Colonel Sanders! Yes, I'm, I'm, a big, I'm, a big, I'm a big, I'm a big fan. I didn't know it's a live stream, actually. Yes, yes. Sonic the Hedgehog fans. <laughs> Finger licking good. Uh, and I live right down the road from the big chicken, which is a KFC. <laughs> I live next to uh, my master emerald. Um, so you're saying you have to get stuff like del delivered, wh whatever you have of in okay, Mobile. Straight from the mask? Yeah, absolutely. They just opened, they just uh, expanded, they just expanded. Um, they just expanded DoorDash to the to the to Angel Island. It's uh, perfect. Really? Absolutely. Yeah. The, yeah. The anim the um the delivery drivers are the animals actually. Um, the birds, right? right? Yes, ab absolutely. The absolutely the birds. Who needs cars? You know, that's right? that true. Those, those fluckies, I tell you. Ab I just found that. I just found out that Uber Eats has made it so that I don't have to be restricted to Florida anymore. I can work anywhere in the country. Hey, nice. There you go. There you go. So let's see so when we got what we got over here with the lots of people, lots of bags. Absolutely. Lots of more people. I see Papa John. I see Papa John's over there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can a big Pikachu. Was he wearing a hat? Yes. I don't know if that was a hat, a hat or their natural hair. I didn't get a chance to see. I see Pikachu. I see Star Wars. I see a, a droid hanging out by one of those cameras over there. Are the droids that Tails loves. Tails wants yeah. to adopt that thing. Absolutely. Yeah. You, I heard you should have seen his face yesterday. 
Oh yeah, yeah. no, uh, man, I uh, yeah, uh, I know, I know, um, I, I know, I mean, I know uh, some a uh, certain somebody mentioned him, uh, certain somebody mentioned to me that uh, about uh, about uh, a shadow onesie, and uh, I'm not entirely. Oh, oh yes, hello, hello. Was- so crunchy, and I'm and I'm just and I forgot exactly what it was. Can you uh, you like just fill me in real quick, Sonic? I'm just curious. Yes, yeah, so we're planning, yeah. planning to wear the best. We're planning to wear shadow onesies at the the movie premiere of Sonic Movie Three. <laughs> hello, hello. That sounds, that sounds about right. Hello. These are cute. <laughs> Those oh, are no, these I had seen before. I guess the question here, Knuckles, is that would you wear a shadow onesie? Yeah, uh, of course. Why the heck not? Give the people one of us, one of us, one of us, one of us. One of us. One of us. Welcome to the fan club. Ab- 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 absolutely. Uh, um, and we're going to. Now, uh, I wonder if they have any places in Angel Island that sell them. Uh, probably not. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. You, you're going to have to go to, like, Amazon or something. And, I mean, we, I'm, we did open a warehouse on Angel Island, so that's so that's, so that actually, that can actually help. Get some, get some more. Get some more. <laughs> you know, Island, she had the key in the lock. Yeah. Right next door to the McMobius. Um, the McMobius. How's that going? It's uh, I mean, it's going, it's going pretty good. It's McMobius. They make money. Um, <laughs> that's the main thing. Absolutely. Making them rings, you know. I was a tourism out there work anyway. Your guess is as good as mine. Uh, I, I didn't even know that airplanes could go that high. How else did McMobius get there? Uh, magic. Yeah. <laughs> magic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, ma- yeah ma- <laughs> magic of... Uh, yeah, sure. Um, when logic fails, magic is the answer. Absolutely, absolutely. With all else... I love your outfits. Can I get a look? I got a live stream here with some Sonic fans. Absolutely. <laughs> Love it. I feel underdressed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're just, we're, we're just wearing shoes and gloves. Yeah. You know, I'm, how are we not banned from, from this convention? I feel like we should put some more clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> it's cold out here today. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Well, me and Tails established that the good guys don't wear clothes. Oh yeah, that's right. That, that, <laughs> that, 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 that's right. That would make me a bad guy, and I'm. Yeah. If that if, that, if that's if that's bad, I don't want to be. I messed that whole sentence up. Uh, <laughs> wow. It, it, it gives me a question, Knuckles. If you could have a bad guy name, what would you call yourself? I, I'm halfway to Rick Harry. Uh. Doing good. Mm, that's an interesting one. Oh, uh, you didn't have anything Sonic the Hedgehog? Sonic the Hedgehog by chance? Aw. Uh, well, he's uh, on the animated series as well, and plus he's got the movies. Have you tried Prime? The Sonic Prime series? It's very new. A couple of, um, a couple of friends showed me them. I was like, I just go for the games. I just like keeping nostalgic. Yeah. Well, the Sonic Prime is pretty good. Uh, which... I'm not why Sonic Prime is my favorite. I think um, that reminds that reminds me. I feel like uh, that reminds me of what's um, what was that one um, iterate? What was that one iteration? Dread. I feel like I feel like that. I feel like that's. I feel like that's a that's a pretty that's a pretty good name for a villain. Knuckles the Dread. Uh, Knuckles the Dread. Mm. Absolutely. I, I feel you call yourself like Chuckles the Echidna. Be like a Joker. That doesn't sound evil though. No. It can be evil. It can be scary. Yeah, I mean, but uh, you, it says in your theme song. It says in your theme song. Yeah, I'm sure you have to do anything for Sonic the Hedgehog. 
Oh, oh don't don't chuckle. That's an that's an excellent point. Yeah, yeah. So, so I mean, imagine if you do chuckle, that would be the the evil side of you. It'd be quite scary, you know. Seeing you chuckle and be like, <laughs> then you punch somebody. It's quite scary. That is all. That is that is true. That is true. I'm all up, and I'm you know I'm uh feel like that. I feel like I feel like uh, chuckling would be. Uh, I feel like uh, chuckling would be going against my uh, beliefs of not chuckling. But uh, I'll I'll certainly do my best. Uh, what? Anyway, <laughs> get some, I'm gonna get some more water. Oh, Colonel Sanders again. What up? Hey. Oh, yes. We love your chicken, dude. It's finger looking good. It's finger looking good. He laughed at that, right? He's not even looking. Never mind. Um. <laughs> Knuckles. What's up? You looking forward to your TV show? Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm looking forward to that. Um, we still haven't heard anything about it either. Absolutely. Even if leakers do try. These are um, <laughs> You just have oh. the two Sonic the Hedgehog ones? I love Shadowbox the art. A hundred dollars. <laughs> Let me squeeze by. Can I squeeze by? Yeah. Thank you. I'll tell you what, the cosplays out here are amazing. Oh yeah, I, I can see it in the video. What like what can, what's been your favorite cosplay so far? Uh, at the convention. Ah, uh, good question. Mm. There's some good ones. Um, mm. that's a neat print. I saw some. I saw some really good Shira cosplays uh, yesterday. Oh, nice. Ooh. I saw Shira and Bo from Shira series. Hey. That's from the newer one. We uh, also saw some Owl House cosplay. Ooh. Oh, nice. Yeah, the, uh, at Momocon last year, there was like a really nice, there was like a really fun Owl House uh, photo shoot. <clears throat> I should maybe coming back this way. Yeah. Oh, there's the Pikachu again. Hey. Hey. That Pikachu. It's He's a Pokemon. So happy. It's one happy Pokemon. Yes, indeed. <laughs> you having fun with your droid today? Oh, I always have fun. <laughs> Here he is again. Your arm's getting tired? My arms are actually hurting. Oh no! I don't even have my arms it's in my arms. Like my arms are on the side of me right now. Uh, At least the arm, the fake arms, just stick out for you. Yeah. <laughs> Get heavy. Yeah, I actually been in here for over an hour. Ooh. Yeah, that's why I'm trying to run to get out. Just run back to the car, huh? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Man, poor Pikachu. Let's <laughs> see, we have two hands up. <laughs> Oh yeah, of course. Let's get them up. Uh, you want to call? You want to call them up, Sonic? Yeah. <laughs> cool. I'm gonna choose movie Amy Rose. Hey everyone. Hi. Hey. Hi. How's it going? <laughs> All right. Dealing with his tails blowing up his workshop again. Oh yeah, I got a, I got uh, a question for for the both of you, Sonic, Sonic and Knuckles. All right. Nope. Awesome. Took, uh, what this is your favorite? What is mm -hmm. the favorite game. to hang out at? Yeah, I know that. yeah, it's like I was I was commenting that I I wish I could do well. I I like saddle. What is your favorite? What hang out? What? Yeah, I got I got everything up to what is your. Do. Oh, okay. What is your favorite? Where is your favorite place to hang out at? Oh, favorite place to hang out with. Uh, favorite place to hang out at. Sonic and Tails. Let's see. Um, well, I don't know about my favorite place to hang out with. My favorite place to hang out at is definitely um, Angel Island because that's you know where the that's where you live. Yeah, that's where I because that's where I live. Uh, I don't really know any know anything else. 
No, I got it. Yeah, I absolutely. I never leave unless uh except for the time except for the times when I leave, but we don't talk about those. Um we do. Yeah, no. Yeah, I I I I shall we say plead the fifth. Um I got one more thing to say. I got one more thing to say. What's up? So you guys were talking about wearing shadow onesies all to the Sonic Movie 3 premiere, right? Oh yeah. Yes. That's yes. the goal. Yeah. But I kinda have a feeling that Knuckles here is probably gonna wear a rouge one more like. Oh Ooh. Ooh. Um, lies and slander. But the, we, you, we were literally just talking about the shadow onesie like a few minutes ago. Uh, I mean, uh, it could. I mean, it could be possible because Rouge mostly fidgets through so much. <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted by a droid. Um, <laughs> Look at the droid. I'm just gonna go now before Tails blows up his workshop again. See. Okay. Okay. Uh, we'll have to discuss that later and I'll go up the whole room one day. The, the other droids real quick. Absolutely. You're also welcome. follow the rules. Anyways, um, <clears throat> let's see. Uh, so, uh, I think uh, it's up to, it's down to me now, right? Uh, for yep. the character. Yeah. So, all right, see, I'll go ahead. There's Absolutely. your wife. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and get, uh, let's see here, uh, Dino Kaiju. Hey. hey. Dino, I mentioned. Hello, everyone. Hey, Dino. Hello. Hello. Ah, all right. All right, Sonic, good to see you again, As since we saw each other yesterday. Yeah, good to see you, too. Yeah. And Knuckles, good to see you. How you been? I'm doing, I'm doing good. Just, just over here, not chocolate, checking on my emerald, uh, uh, which I somehow brought to this convention. Don't ask why. Uh, and uh, I'm just <laughs> over here looking. And I'm just over here looking at R2D2 over here. Oh, nice! That looks great. I got a live stream going on my phone for the Sonic community. Absolutely. That is pure dedication to repaint all that stuff. Absolutely. There are like dedicated Star Wars groups out there, like for not just cosplayers, but for like props and all that stuff. Oh yeah, that R2 T2 got that drip. It's awesome. And shiny and droid. too. And droid is so futuristic. I love it. It's got blue. It's got blue in him. That's okay. my favorite. And and then there's the and there's the Rebo favorite, the BB the BB unit over there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm calling it right now. That's the Rebo favorite. I can tell because Tails loves it so much. <laughs> he does. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, such a yeah. good thing. Oh wait, really? wait a second. You said that you got the master emerald here. I assume people, if people would say that, they would think that it's a prop or something instead of being the real thing. Um, that's a good question. <laughs> yeah, that is a that is a good question. We're, okay, okay, we saw the droid. Where are the apples at? Um. Uh. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, so uh, um. Anywho, so my question is actually for both Sonic and Knuckles. All right. All right. So uh, it's actually um, I, I was actually going to ask this as well with uh, Tails yesterday, but I kind of forgot. But uh, but um, but but since uh, since the two of you are involved, so I'm quite curious from you, you guys. Um, uh, how's the process for you two on making the team blast attack in Sonic Heroes? Hmm. That's a. I feel like uh, like Sonic over here could be uh, could uh, answer to could answer this. No, uh, no. I feel like they can answer it better. It just takes a lot of teamwork, a lot of speed, um, precision, and because um, you know we need Knuckles' strength first to swing us around, and then Tails has to kick me and everything, and I have to use my speed. It's a, it's a very lots of uh, it's it's a strong process. You know, it takes right, a lot yeah. of team, you know it's it's it wouldn't work without Knuckles' strength. Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, especially the way he swings around like a tornado. You know, it's like whoosh, 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 whoosh. Yeah, every like, day, like, all, like, all day, I mean, every day. Yeah, exactly. I mean, poor Tails, poor sadly gets sick, but you know, it's it's worth it. Also, hi, Batman. Hey, hey Batman. Uh, snap. And, oh, oh, dear. It's that guy. 
And Eggman. <laughs> it's Eggman as a as a as a different scientist. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you feel like you should you should probably get that checked out. Are you good? <laughs> I think. <laughs> Uh, where were we? Oh yeah. Um, but yeah, like you know, Knuckles swinging around, and then Tails doing his uh thunder shot. I think it's called his thunder shot. Yeah, uh, thing yeah he's called. Thunder. And then yeah, yeah it's, uh, and then Sonic going all blast away, and then going around, yeah. and he's going like, and then all the robots exploding. Uh, yeah. And when, it's, it's, even what I love that, that even after the team blast, like when you're nearby attacks, you still like like you. I, I played the GameCube version, so when you press B, you still like do the attack either way, like a like kind of like the light speed dash attack, if you know what I mean. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a bit like yeah. that. It's really fun. It's yeah, really fun. Of. I love oh, shouting yeah. out last away all the time. It's just so fun. <laughs> there you go. Oh, that's awesome. Yes. And, uh, I love say, and I love saying shoot rock. Ah, uh. Uh, OK. Yeah, and yeah. and fire is in your in your hands and all that. It's like saying the power of the sun in the pop, the power of the sun in the palm of my hands, like in Spider Man Two. Yeah, absolutely. The po- the power of the rock compels me. Um, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, that was really oh, stupid. Yeah. Forget I, anyway. That was stupid. Forget I said that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, Knuckles. It's all in good fun. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> it was, well, I don't want to take too long. I know some people want to ask some questions as well. And uh, yeah, I um, guess I'll catch you guys later. Um, yeah, have fun at the convention. Absolutely. We will We will do that. Oh, they already left. Um, See you soon. Uh, I have a question. What's up? Uh, in the Sonic OVA, when you introduce your, you're talking to the president, you... Introduce yourself as Sonic's best friend. Do you still find that tr- to be true? Uh, I would, I would say, I would say so. I mean, sure, we have, you know, we got our, we got our tussles and such, but yeah. you know, it, it's it's very, it's you know, it's very friendly butt kicking, um, by me, uh, you know, so it's uh, it's 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 it's, it's, a, it's a fun time, um. Uh, wouldn't you say? Wouldn't you say? Wouldn't you say Sonic? I don't know why it took so hard for me to say your name. Uh, I, I know how yeah. to talk. I swear, it's all right. Uh, I'll say so. Yeah, we're, we're good buds. I mean, Tails is my best best friend. No, no offense, Knuckles. But, um, yeah, Knuckles is one of my good friends. All right. He's, he's, if, if, yeah. When he's not being uh, tricked by Eggman, of course. Oh yeah, he's a big gullible guy. I'm oh, look, at that. look at that, guys. Guess who's at our table? Oh, uh, who? Hey, the oh, hey. Hey. There we go. Speaking of fleeting the fifth, robots. Um, <laughs> that has nothing to do with no, those things, have nothing to do with each other, but I don't care. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, hey, do enjoyed. <laughs> Tails loves you. Tails wants to adopt you. You should have seen the look on his face yesterday. Oh, yeah, I know. He caught my voice actor disappointment yesterday. It was great. Uh, if only Tails were here right now, it's just like, hey! Yeah, Tails hey. would be like, oh, yes. Absolutely. Shout out, shout, out to, <laughs> shout out to all the droids out there. Yeah, Tails would be a real Oh, yeah, for sure. Be like, oh my gosh, come here, please. Oh, yeah. <laughs> don't, don't, don't fall. Don't fall. You, get, you, get, you need some water there, droid. <laughs> need some oil. Uh, yeah, need some oil change. Yeah. Like, woo, woo, woo. It's funny because that it's funny because that's water for robots. Um, yeah. I love the silence following that statement. So do I. <laughs> I believe there's a hand, hand rate, so I'll get him up. Bolt. Just, just do that. Yes. Hey, Bolt. Hey, hey, hey. How's it going? Expecting that because I'm, I literally am the only one with their hand raised. There we go. There we go. You, you're, the, you're the grand prize winner. I actually was one of the first um, people to get here. You know, the early bird gets the worm. There we go. Four. 
There you go. There was, there, was, there, was, there was a couple of people that had their hands before you, but you're still you're early enough. That's the important thing. Uh. Yep. Oh yeah. Funny enough, um, when y'all mentioned Colonel Sanders, um, I'm actually from Kentucky, by the way. Oh, there you go. There you go. Right. But That's yeah, my crazy. question is for Knuckles. Like, I know you weren't in um, <laughs> well, the whole Sonic and Leash thing, but um. What would be your reaction if you saw Sonic in his uh, werehog form? I feel like it would be. Uh, I mean, the first thing. I, I mean, the first thing I would think is. I mean, the first thing I would think is, man, Sonic needs to shave. Um, hey. Well, I well, I mean, all that. I mean, all. I mean, all that extra fur and stuff. You know, you got. You know, you, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta get to the old razor every once in a while. Um, and then you. you yeah, you, you know, uh, I mean, how many of that? How much of that facial hair was? How much of that facial hair was there before Eggman uh, did the thing? Um, well, I'm quite hairy now. You're I not mean, hairy, you're furry. There's a difference. Yeah, at, yeah, because I'm I'm the same. I'm the same way. I got fur all over me. Um, <laughs> um, I mean, I guess that kind of made up for him not having fur like Shadow and Silver. That's that's true, I guess. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Uh, I don't know if I answered the question or not. But... Yeah, you did. <laughs> okay. Right. And that um, I'll probably be at other panels later, and I'll see you guys some other time. All right. See you around. Absolutely, absolutely. And yes, uh, appar- apparently we. Uh, I I forgot about this fandom because Dino God, you just said, "Oh no, shaved werehog," and then put and then put them. Oh yeah. my god! Yeah, Tonic, I'm curious. You remember when, like, when you when you came out of the water and then you sh- took it off and you were like a big ball of fluff? Does that still happen? Yeah, pretty much. Quite often, actually. Interesting. The robots. Oh. Yeah, so robots. They're nice. Yeah, unless unless they're unless they're made by unless they're made by an egghead. Yeah. <laughs> it's just don't just, just don't just don't trust egg like in general. <laughs> unless it's Eggman, then that's different. Yeah. No, don't trust Eggman. What do you? Oh, what do you I, mean? I oh, oh, I'm trying. I thought you said don't drop egg. egg. <laughs> I think it's just you gotta have you gotta know oh, yeah. the difference. Yeah, that's why I don't trust that. Yeah, no. I'm, I mean, don't get me wrong. We love dropping Eggman. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, it's in, fun all the time. Absolutely. We'll probably we'll probably do it after we'll probably do it after this panel just because we feel like it. Yeah, yeah, because we feel like it. We're just gonna go over there and push Eggman off his machine and watch him fall. Exactly, yeah. and and they'll and they'll be like, "Why did you do that?" And we'll be like, "It's Sunday." <laughs> so, <laughs> I mean, hey, he was Humpty Dumpty in that one comic. Remember Sonic? Yeah, that that was. I thought that was written in his honor. Yeah, yeah I remember can that. Y'all, yeah, can y'all still hear me? Yes. Okay. Okay. I was just saying. The, yeah, the big difference is that droids are good and bad nicks are bad. Yes. Yeah, that's where the cool bad nicks. Absolutely. <laughs> There ain't, there ain't no, there ain't no, ain't no good nicks up in here. See this little, see this little well, except, droid. Except, except for Belle, she's a good neck. Well, did y'all see that little droid that just passed by? No. Oh, the Star yeah. Wars game. oh snap! We don't see it anymore, but I wish I could see. It. Yeah, it, it rolled off. It rolled away. Uh, oh, dang! R.I.P. Little thing here. They're interacting. Oh hey, snap! Hey. All these droids, no Apple. Oh, Katie's gonna give us a close up. Oh, there we go. We got, we got so, that. Uh, we got the VIP seats. Look at it go. That's pretty good speed, you know. Absolutely, man. It, it's almost as fast as you. Almost, almost. Oh, where's Tails? Tails would love this. He'd be like, ah, no. <laughs> Tails is missing out. Yeah. Today was Tails' day. Oh, he yeah. He when he sees Cosmo, even if he denies it. Yeah. Absolutely. Ooh, a dog. Ooh, a droid. Ooh, another droid. 
<laughs> I don't see the other droid anymore. Ah, well. Why don't you do one-handed? Oh, food. Yeah, I'm trying to film one-handed. I need salt. Okay, cool. Thank you. I don't have salt, salt pack. I got ketchup. You got ketchup? Ooh. Ketchup! I came in at the right time, didn't I? Yes. Mm. I didn't know one out here. Oh my God. <laughs> now I want McMobies again. Yeah, I want some fries. Yeah. Oh, look at the little droid. I think it's not up behind us. Yeah, it is now like right behind us. Oh. Yeah. It's lunchtime. Oh, I saw someone with a Knuckles um, backpack. Good taste. Chicken McNuggy. Pull pork salad for me. Oh, you got pulled pork? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh, most fries look. Oh, must resist urge. Uh, to reference a previous joke. Um, anyway, who, here, um, who, like, who here likes chicken? I do. Yeah, I do. Quite tasty, actually. As, as long as it's not made from the animals on my island, I'm good. Yeah, you know, so I speak, speaking of food, like what what's your secret to a good homemade chili for the for the chili dog? Ooh, what's my secret? Uh, well, like, it's uh, like passion, love, chili, spices, pepper, cheese, onions. I know passion was an ingredient. Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. It's always an ingredient for a good food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Absolutely. I, just, I don't know if you can season them. I don't know if you can put emotions as a season, but it's, uh, yeah, I, I, I love it. None, I love the this recipe so far, nonetheless. Um, anyway. So, how about the airline food, huh? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. How about that airline food? Let's see if anybody... Too expensive. Oh, yeah, for... Oh, yeah, for sure. Hey, um... <laughs> Oh, nuts. What's like your favorite recipe for foods? Like, what's your biggest favorite thing of all time besides grapes? Um, let me think. Besides uh, grapes, that's going to be a difficult one. Um, how about uh, grape juice? Grape juice is pretty. Yeah. That is aside you? from grape. Um, we got right. Yeah, uh, I got the so right here. We're going to be in Ca uh, Carson, California, on June thirtieth. Okay. That's my favorite yep. recipe right there. Um, Last weekend of October. Oh really? Yeah. And we're working to try to get something out here in Florida within the next couple of years. That would be awesome. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Speaking of Florida, I do like Florida oranges. Um, that is true. Yeah. So those, so that's for, so that's pretty so that's pretty good. Um. Uh, I mean, I like. I mean, I. I mean, I'll. I'll partake in a chili dog every once in a. You know, every hey, once in a while. But yeah, you know, we're I'm, talking. Yeah. Uh, yeah. False advertising. I never feel like running after I eat them. But um, oh, really, I do. I run all the time. I eat like twenty five chili dogs, then run. Twenty five. Burn it off. Twenty five. Yeah, twenty five chili dogs. Your digestive system is a force of nature. That is a. <laughs> it's because kind of, they burn it off so fast, you know, high metabolism. That yeah, is, I was gonna say. That is true. I'm, I mean, that is that's true. I mean, uh, I mean, grapes give me that fuel. You know, I mean, I I get I have I have, I have them by the vine. A lot of you know, a lot of uh, grapes, grape uh, grape juice, grape flavored ice cream, grape flavored um, uh, <laughs> other stuff. Yeah. Um, what about mints? Have you had like a mint flavored ice cream? Do you like mints? Um, I mean, I mean, I mean, yes, but like Tails usually eats them all. Um, that's true. Yeah, we never get a chance. Yeah, yeah we, we we should probably we should probably host an intervention. I was saying, fucking trap kid, real quick. <laughs> yeah, just check them into mint rehab. Yeah, well, if that doesn't work, I'm sure Cosmo can give them. Cosmo can give them the intervention. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely, <laughs> and we'll and we'll have and we'll have and we'll have peppermints right there on the table, and because yeah. uh, they're they're totally not the same thing. <laughs> um. 
So, Nux, um, how are things with you and Rouge? Is there anything going on between you two, or say what? <laughs> you, know, you and Rouge, is there like anything going on? You guys, you know, doing uh, anything together, or I mean, uh, you know, just uh, I don't know, but I mean, if you count the times that I'm trying to shoo them away from my, uh, from my, and by from this green, lo- this big green master little sucker right here then uh then yeah we've done some stuff together uh and uh, <laughs> uh excuse me so i got a little tickle in my throat um oh, no. I think, yeah i know yeah i know um but you know uh i i um i plead something uh I don't know if I. Yes, I uh, maybe. Mike, it could be. It could be. The, it could be the fourteenth. You never know. You never know. Um, or the. I don't know why that one specifically. I just. I just thought of that. Um, yeah, it's like your catchphrase now. I plead the fourteenth or the. Oh, 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 oh! oh you mean fourteen minus nine? Got you, got you. The fifth. So, is uh, any more hands want to be raised? Yeah, um, yeah. Get him, get them up. Uh, I don't know why he said it oh, like yeah. that. That sounded weird. Um, oh my god! I don't care, man. Maybe hey, my people raise your hands for a question. I'll, I'll be glad to call. If you have a question, raise your hands. Absolutely. That somebody leave. Apparently. Uh, <laughs> oh no! no. We love, we love you too. Up. We scared them off. <laughs> Yeah. Maybe um, maybe we can get some improv going until then. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. absolutely. Uh, uh, cool. Uh, um, um, don't throw a okay. suggestion. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, 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 someone do that. Uh, give us a situation, uh, Kev. Give us a like a situation. Hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, let Let's see. So, so, so you and Knuckles, you're, you're at the. You have the master emerald and whoop, fruit, fruit appears and you're trying to sh- shoo her away. Even though Rouge isn't in the air. Go for it. All right. Okay. Yeah. Rouge, get out of here. Leave Knuckles alone. Yeah. You, you, you heard, you heard the man, you heard the man, you heard the man, Rouge. I'm totally not speaking to a wall. Get, get, him, get, him, get away from my, get away from my thing. Get away from this. That's, that's not yours. It's, uh, it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, uh, you know, it's, uh, you know, Knuckles is. It is his yeah, yeah. private property. It, it it belongs to him. Absolutely, absolutely. It's my it's my private prop. It's my private property, and uh, I don't know. I, I mean, you know, it's it's not so private if you can see it, but it, it's 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 private to me. Dang it! It's you know it's uh it's all pow- all powerful, and you know I'm, I'm the I'm the I'm the last of my kind. Here I come, rougher than the rest of them, the best of them, tougher than leather. Unlike Sonic, I don't chuckle all that jazz. You know, you uh, laugh sometimes. You do laugh sometimes, Knuckles. I've heard you laugh. Yeah, I mean, you did laugh in episode fifty-two of Sonic X one time. That was mm. that was a deep fake. Um, that, not a uh, deep fake. Uh, and, <laughs> and your improv get that enough to get a hand raise, trigger or two hands. It's, it works. Perfect. An athlete. Oh, there we go. Uh, Got two hands. Trigger me. Hands, everybody. Absolutely. Put your hands in the air and wave them like you care enough to ask a question. Oh, shit. Is it working? Uh, Okay. I can, I can, I can see you guys are talking, but I can't hear you. Yeah, I can hear you. Uh, well, we can hear you. Uh, the whole world can hear you. Everyone. <laughs> hey, let me try to move you back and then move you on. Uh, Here we go. We are on international broadcast. Uh, robots. Okay. Welcome. Welcome back. Okay. Now, now I can hear you guys. Sweet. Absolutely. Hey. Yeah. Okay. I feel like my question is going to cause a lot of beef in this panel, but I think it's worth asking anyway. <laughs> uh, we'll go, we'll go. All right. Go ahead. Why not? So, there's been a lot of times where you, Sonic and Knuckles, have fought each other in the past, but either the outcome would either be A, 
what if you guys would escape or B, it would end in a tie. Were there ever, were there any, ever, bleh, I can't get it out. <laughs> were there ever any fights between you two where one were, bleh, why is this question so hard to ask? <laughs> you need some, need some water, needs, needs some juice. Need me to, need to call a doctor. Or- I think, uh, <laughs> I think I need a wake up call of anything. All right. I'll try it again. <laughs> Was there ever a time you two fought each other and one of you won over the other? God, why was that so hard to say? <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine, but that's okay. It's uh, a good question, actually. I mean, every time we usually like, we just tie. We just put our differences aside and. Either that no, or one of you two would escape and the fight wouldn't end. Well, actually, there was that one time in uh, Sonic Advance 2 where I won, where Knuckles was riding the machine trying to kill me. Yeah, that was... Uh... What happened there, Knuckles? Why did you do that? Um, I... Uh, what? I think this is the part where you plead the fifth. <laughs> I, 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 I plead uh, one plus four. Um... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that 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 that, that equals five. Uh, I'm pleading that. Oh no, I miscounted. I thought it was fourteen. Oh no, yeah, I it was Plead twenty-five. Oh, <laughs> I, 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 if yeah, fourteen comes after five, definitely. Oh, um, numerals, everybody. Yeah, what's nine? What's nine plus ten? Twenty-one. Everybody, knows a difficult about. number. <laughs> The little the food stands. Okay. And I think there's a third one in the room straight that, that way. Did I answer your question okay though, Tugger? Yeah, that answered my question. Okay. Well, See you guys around. All right. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm glad yeah. that made sense to somebody. Um let's call the next person. Let's go for Ashley. Absolutely. Uh Ashley the <laughs> There they are. Hello. Hey, hey, hey. hey, what's your question? My question is for Sonic more like. Who? Sonic, what is your favorite? What is your favorite trick? Like soda, water, my favorite, water, whatever. Favorite well, drink, I heard. Do you like it? I do. I do love apple juice. That's quite nice. I'm more. Of a, I'm more of like a, kind of a fruit guy. You know, I love my juices. Apple, orange juice. Oh, no. that's nice that, stuff. That's like a really good na- natural drink, na- na- right. not destroy one. Yeah, I don't drink much fizzy or soda. You know. Uh, me neither, unless it's grape soda. Um. I mean, I like, uh, you know, I like grape juice. I like grape apple juice. I like grape cranberry juice. I like, um, you love everything grape. Yes. I, yeah, I, 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 I love everything grape juice as well. Um, it's, uh, it has, that has like five different types of grapes in it. You know, it's, uh, I didn't even know, I didn't even know that was something that existed. Um, I see we have one extra hand up. Uh, we do. Bring them up. Yes, yes, absolutely. Hey, Radar. What's going on? How you doing? How's it going? You're not no longer muted. Let's go. (laughs) Yo, oh my gosh. Is that October 18th, 1994's hit game Sonic and Knuckles? It is now. Oddly specific, but yeah. I don't know why I made that a joke, but I did. (laughs) You you Uh, did. You you, you did. You made this bed lie in it. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> uh, and to be fair, it's the it, it, it. To be fair, like I can only do that joke with just you two, so it's special. <laughs> that is that is very that is very true. We it's definitely true. approve of it. We definitely we you, yeah two thumbs up. Absolutely, absolutely, t- absolutely two. Uh, well, technically four. Uh, do I even have four thumbs, thumbs up? I. I my my thumbs are in these gloves somewhere. Anyway, uh, so uh, what's your question? Uh, I was I was I was just uh, actually going to uh, excuse me. Uh, I'm still waking up. Sorry. Uh, my question is actually for you, Knuckles. 
Ooh, um, okay. Uh, how excited are you for uh, your movie counterpart for his TV show? Been hearing some more stuff come out about it, and I wanted to know your thoughts on it. Ooh, uh, let's. Um, my movie counter. Oh, oh, yes, yes, yes. I know what you're talking about now. I know what you're talking about now. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, 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 the TV show is going to be real. Oh yes, I'm looking. I'm. Uh, I'm honestly looking forward. I'm honestly looking forward to it, and. Uh, you know, I can't wait to see what, uh, can't see what, can't wait to see. I know how to say sentences. I swear what, uh, you know, what, uh, you know, how, how it turns out. I feel like it's going to be great because I'm in it or my movie, movie me is in it anyway. And, uh, okay. and, and, yeah, and you know, me, me, me is excited. <laughs> We're all uh, excited. Uh, uh, don't know if Sonic and Tails will make a cameo, but I'm sure hoping so. We at least get to see just a little bit before movie three comes out, because then all three, all three of you will get to uh, uh, shine uh, and whip shadow, of course, too. There, yeah, of course. Gotta be yeah, a they, yeah, there we go. Paramount, get to work on it. Uh, they, that would be awesome. Uh, this year is going to be wild. Oh, gosh. Uh, in more ways than one, absolutely. Uh, oh, Deadpool! <laughs> What's oh, going on, Deadpool? <laughs> no way! I love Ryan Reynolds. Uh, that was perfect. That was just perfect timing. <laughs> uh, well, that certainly answers my question. Thanks, Knuckles. Absolutely. I'm glad that Deadpool answered your question. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, thank thanks. You. Thanks, guys. No problem. Thank you, Radar. No worries. You guys have a nice time. <laughs> you win. Absolutely. A joint guy under the table. Oh. Oh, dang. R.I.P. to that poor droid. Yo, oh, poor droid. Say I next. believe uh, Dra- Drago <laughs> had a question next. I caught that on film. Absolutely. Hello. Oh. Hey. Hello. Almost four in the morning for me, so. Yeah, you are. You are. Yeah. Yeah. You are really, 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 really quiet. <laughs> yeah. I rewrite the week. It's like, I don't want to wake up my brother. Anyways, my question is: uh, It's been home. Pretty good. My head. Sorry. Well, now I remember. Uh, if you guys ever wanted to upgrade better equipment than you had previously, what would you like your upgrades for your current gear? I heard veteran group equipment. Um, like I so, said, upgrade. What upgrades would you like to? You know, oh, yeah. Equipment would you like? Would we like for, for our equipment? Oh, uh, uh, oh. I would like the ability to um fly. Turn R two up. Yeah, the fine yeah, equipment. Uh, you mean like our powers and such, or yes, the, the yeah, power ups are getting Sonic Adventure. Oh, got you. Um, and Sonic Adventure too. <laughs> and Adventure too. Mm. Uh, well, like I said, I would like to fly. You know, I'll let have some kind of like hover boots that allow me to glide to different places. That'd be quite awesome. And maybe some kind of like sticky gloves so I can like climb walls like Spider-Man. Or me. Like um, gloves with small climbing claws? Yeah, sort of like that. A bit like Sonic Prime. That'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. Um, I mean, I would like uh, I mean, definitely I mean, definitely I would like to be able to uh, I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe some air shoes could come in handy, just so I, you know, just so I'd be able to, uh, I'd be able to catch up to you, uh, speed wise. Uh, and uh, what, what was your other? Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, what was your other idea? Sorry, I misheard. I didn't hear. No, well, I was. I didn't want to interrupt you. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. The idea I had was like the up- an upgrade for your shovel claws. They can become drill claws, which enable you to even break through with much tougher materials. That is true. That is true. I could pro- I could probably break through. Uh, break through Eggman's jaws. Yeah, I was about to say. I was about to say. What can I not break? Um, 
That's 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 a pretty disturbing flex. Uh, but I, I can I can break through a lot of things. Uh, but yeah, breaking through that jaw would be pretty nice. Uh, I mean, I've I've been able to knock you out of your suit before before. So that's true. Uh, that is a few moments. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, a bit ago, I saw R two D two a bit ago. <laughs> absolutely. Uh, I could I could punch that R two D two, but I don't want to because it's uh, it's it's adorable. You leave those droids alone, Knuckles. I did. I, I said I wasn't going to because they're adorable. <laughs> but you were thinking it. You were thinking of doing it. Yeah, that is lies and slander. <laughs> anyways, I gotta get. Anyways, I gotta get going because I'll. He's going to be guys in later panels, but I have to keep cold because it's going to be 47 degrees where I am. Oh, man. It's going to be a hot day for me. It's getting pretty cold up in Angel Island right now, so I feel you. Uh, Yeah, it's cold here, too. Absolutely. Green Hill, my foot. Um, You know, one last thing. We we somebody had a good improv idea was to stop for Sonic to convince Knuckles to cosplay. Ooh. (laughs) The cosplay, you say? Yeah, that was a suggestion from Dino Kaiju. Mm. Okay, let's do this. Knuckles, come on, dude! You gotta cosplay as this character. You gotta dress as Big the Cat. Uh, I'm, I'm not even. I'm not even that. I'm not even that big. Boom, boom me is pretty big, but I don't know. I don't know if it's that kind of big. Uh, Look, you gotta, you gotta cosplay as Big the Cat, or the other costume I got is Rouge. You got to pick one of them. I'll choose big. Actually, I feel like that would be. Uh, that, that, I feel like that would actually be perfect for my size. Um, you know, I, I've, I'm, I've, I mean, you know, I've, I've lost a little. I've lost a little weight. <laughs> Make it work. Um, yeah, put it on, Nux. Go on, put it on, put it on. Ab- ab- absolutely. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, you know, you know what? You're right. It's it's way too large. It's too big for you, man. I could, ooh man, you could you could fit them out. You could fit the, you could fit the the the, the thing uh, the thing. I'm not gonna give anybody ideas on in here. Uh, By the chaotix. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, t- yeah. The the chaotix. You could you could you could fit, you could fit ve- a vector charmy, uh, <laughs> my uh, mighty SBO. All that you could fit them all in here. Uh, it's a. Uh, Matter of fact, they should. Matter of fact, they should do this cosplay. And uh, oh wait, they're not even. They're not even. Uh, whatever. Um, you know what? You know what? No, so you're gonna have to wear the rouge cosplay then. No, actually, actually, no. no forget the chaotics. I'm, 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 I'm just gonna go. You know. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't feel white. I don't feel right wearing the, the wearing an emerald thief on. Uh, what? Uh, you might. You might look kind of good in that rouge costume. Yeah, think of the boots. You get to wear these nice boots. Hmm. Uh, I mean, I mean, um, uh, I'm not gonna. I'm, you know, I mean, you, you, come on, you're thinking about it. You got. I don't know. Maybe I'll look good in high heels. I don't know. Um, I, I think so. Give it a go. You don't know till you try. So why not? But don't, don't, but don't, 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 don't tell any, don't, don't, don't tell anybody anything. This is totally not a live stream. Um. Yeah, it's totally not live streaming right now. Abs- abs- absolutely. And if anybody asks, I'll just plead the fifth on them. Uh, let's see here. Um, let me try this on. Ooh, looking nice, Nux. Not going to lie. I got that drip on. Yeah. There you go. Carton 4K. I know. No, you you didn't catch any. You didn't catch anything in 4K. Not even not even not even uh, ten, not even 640 by 480. You didn't you didn't catch anything there. I'm just uh uh, robots, R- more robots. <laughs> wow, way to deflect. Yes, ab- absolutely. Uh, you know, it's um, <laughs> oh, I, that's what that that's that's in my job description. Uh, no, it's not. Why did I say that? Uh, it's like uh, guarding the master emerald, actually. Uh, which I feel like yeah, we should probably start job. doing. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I, I do a, I do a. Fantastic job. And uh Yeah, and now you can protect the master of just in Rouge. Absolute. Absolutely. And uh I'll be what did you say? 
I said, let's wrap it up. Oh yes, we should. We oh, should start yeah. wrapping it up. I can check out the Master Emerald. Uh, yeah. Uh, so Kevin. Uh, yeah. Was there any anything you'd like to say before we uh, before for you to wrap up? Uh, the previous conversation never happened, and uh, yeah. and uh, I and this, but this has been fun. Thanks for having us on, and and uh, have a great rest of the convention. It's been fun. You're I'll be back soon. Absolutely, yeah. and I won't be. Uh, so, uh, but yeah, y'all have a good y'all have a good con. See you around. See you. See you, Max. Yeah, I have the mic at the, on you at the moment. Same because okay, you're still got a question here. Uh, hey, question when when Andy comes in. Uh, there, there you are, mm-hmm. Andy. Hey. Yep. I'm going to go and eat some lunch, and also I'll I'll be back later. All right. And then we need to hello everyone. Hey, I believe we're just waiting for uh, Sonic and Shadow. Yep, just yeah, waiting on Sonic. Sonic. I have oh, returned. Hello. You have returned. <laughs> oh, and there's Shadow. Let me just get him up here. Yeah, where's Shadow? Oh, where is Shadow. that? Where is Shadow? Shadow? Yeah, he's he's right there. Hey, Shadow. Hey, Shadow. Oh, Shadow. There you are. Hey, is there a particular reason why I'm being called upon this day? Uh, yeah. <laughs> we're, at, we're at Central Florida Comic Con today, and we thought we uh, have some some of you guys come up and, um, I don't know, just do some improv and stuff. Yeah. Ah, I see. Yeah. So I've been brought in as entertainment then. Yes, yes, you have. I yeah. can't yeah. say that I approve of this. But any chance I have to show that I'm better than that faker, I'll gladly take. Hey, hey, hey. Let's not go there, hey, Shadow. We're good buddies today. We're, we're, we're friends. <laughs> Friendship is questionable. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say toleration at best. <laughs> For a lack of a better oh, word. It's on. Are you sure about that? Yep. <laughs> I think Dolly Fitz is going to be quite interesting. Don't you agree, Angie? Yeah. <laughs> so you can see, Shadow, we got a good view right here. Yes, okay. I can see that. It seems like Look. there's quite a good amount of people at that convention. There's a lot of Star uh, Wars stuff. Let's enjoy it. Star mm-hmm. Wars. Mm-hmm. I suppose that would be appealing to a few of our voice cast, as I recall. <laughs> Oh yes. Uh, we oh, also indeed. got some Ghostbusters down down the way. Uh oh. Mm. Ooh, Ghostbusters. Ooh. <laughs> Unlike Knuckles, I ain't afraid of no ghost. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and you can feel free to tell him that I said that. I will definitely relay that message to him. I'll, I'll let him know. Good. Anyways. Like, quite a few uh, Star Wars tables across the way from us. Mm-hmm. Very nice. It looks Pretty like cool. you're in a stadium. Yeah, it does look like we're in an arena. Oh, it's an mm. arena. Oh. Ooh. Ah, the arena where the greatest of battles are fought. I can't Not be the only one. Arena. <laughs> I can't be the only one that thinks of Super Smash Bros. When I see the we see this arena, right? When you think of what? <laughs> I, Smash Bros. When I take a look at this arena, I think of, like, the game, uh, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I think of it, but yeah. sadly, I'm too powerful to be seen as a fighter, so they relegated me to an assist. No, it's because you're not powerful enough. No, <laughs> it's clearly more. because I'm more powerful than all of their current roster. Therefore, they can't have me fighting because I'd always win. Hey, look, there's us, Shadow. I'm happy. Oh, you're really? sad. You need to smile more often. <laughs> no. I'm a happy hedgehog. Come on. Yeah, exactly. You gotta I be a happy hedgehog. When I feel like it. It's oh, my on, choice smiling. to make. Hedgehog. You're always smiling, Sonic. I, I'm always smiling. <laughs> Smiles, you know, make the world go round, you know, makes everyone exactly. happy, you know? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Or it adds to the annoyance of other people. What do you mean? Uh, don't be it's like that. I He's mean, really, it. sometimes people are in bad moods and having someone constantly positive and constantly trying to tell them to, hey, smile more, isn't always going to fix that problem, now is it? Are you talking about yourself? 
No, I'm not Shadow's talking about point. myself. Mm. I have a point. Is that point really catching on? Think about it. If someone is down in the dumps, Ooh. the last thing they'd want is for someone to constantly be telling them, hey, smile more. You'll be better. You'll feel better. No, that mm. doesn't work. That's not how psychology works. That's not how emotions work. You have to give them the right amount of time. Yeah, I guess you're right. Of course I'm right. Yeah. Okay. How about that, everyone? Food? <laughs> I'm always right. Always? Not always. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I he has to say always. Name one time where I was incorrect about something. Uh, um, hold on, let me think. Um, there's gotta be one somewhere. Uh, dad, um, hmm. Um, I rest my um, case. I'm oh, dead. Uh, you know, there, there's gotta be one. I think there's one. Um, hmm. <laughs> Go on. I'm waiting, Faker. Hey, that's my line. Yes, I guess you could say you were too slow. Oh, shut up. That's fire. also my line. I could do this all day. I mean, I could probably name one thing you're probably wrong about. Oh, really? And what? what was it? Uh, needing to destroy the world. Oh, yeah, there you go. Here's one. Okay. After being in stasis for 50 years, your mind gets jumbled on a lot of things. So I'm not going to blame myself on that one. That, that I'm going to chalk, chalk up to uh, post-stasis amnesia. Yes. Also not my fault. Technically, kind of is, since you almost did destroy the well, if you uh, know no what's world. Good you, you'll be quiet before anything else happens. Uh, okay. But it was your fault, Shadow. You're the, you're the one that was kind of pushing the whole thing with the Chaos Emeralds and the cannon and the Space Colony Arc. It's exactly as what, as what Drago said. Technically, Gerald changed my memories. So again, not my fault. Not my fault at all. <laughs> Go on, I'm still waiting. Name one thing I'm wrong about. I dare you. Hey, Lee, there's people waving at us. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. hey. Hello there. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to What's the up, Shadow everybody? Revolution table. It should be called the Shadow Revolution table, but I digress. Nah, the Shadow Revolution doesn't sound appealing enough. Yes, it does. It sounds quite edgy, you know? It sounds better. Nah. Sonic Revolution sounds so much more, like, you know, cool. Shadow Revolution sounds dark, mysterious, edgy. That's why it's Sonic more intriguing. Flows better. That's it was why it's more it. intriguing, it's Sonic. If it's dark and mysterious, it'll have an allure that makes people want to show up. It'll make people want to tune in. It'll make them curious as to what we get up to here. And that's exactly the point, is it not? Well, I guess so, but... I exactly. guess my name has so a, once again, my, I'm right. You're not right. <laughs> You're not right. You just admitted it by your own speech. I, I was saying I said kind of. I said kind of. I didn't say I hundred percent agree. I was just saying, yeah, I kind guess of I see it's the same difference. It still means that I'm right. It doesn't mean no, no, it doesn't Yes, it does. It doesn't, no, you it admitted doesn't. it, therefore I'm right. This oh, conversation boy. is over. I win. <sighs> Technically, Shadow, when it comes to Sonic Revolution, it's re re well, representing all of you guys, not just one person. <laughs> yeah, my, my, name, so is, my, letting, my name has a worldwide appeal. the others have time in the spotlight because everyone wants to see me. <laughs> uh, I mean, just think about it. People have been wanting to see me playable since Sonic the Hedgehog 2006. What's that game? You know, I oddly don't have enough memory about what happened in that game, but I know it exists because people talk about it a lot. Mm. But apparently I kicked Silver in the back of the head, and I do remember that, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, uh, how about we get on with some improv? Katie is up to something. Lenny? Sure. She's over here doing something. Ah, oh, yes, the other 2005 game. Yes, that was the best game. Because it was my game. What, your game? Oh, your game was not that good. Yes, it was. It was the ultimate game. You, you, like, look, you were meant to be so fast, but you're riding a bike. It adds to my coolness factor. Yeah, it just proves that you're slow. 
Not as fast no, as I am. Doesn't. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, it does. I don't see you riding on a cool motorcycle. I don't need to, because I'm cool enough. Hmm. As if. But anyway, what's this improv you're wanting us to do, Chris? Hmm. Wanted to see how this would actually go. You remember that whole line of I found you, Faker? How about we switch it around? Shadow, you be saying I found you, Faker. And Chet and Sonic be doing the other part. Are you kidding me? You want me to quote his lines? You want me to quote his lines? Yes. (laughs) Come on. Oh, yeah, guys. Bring it a little closer. Look at that. No revolution. Exactly. It's the best (laughs) option. We should rename it immediately. <laughs> oh, brother. This should 100% be the title of the convention going forward. <laughs> ego much? No, it's not ego. It's facts. And I'm spitting. Okay. But anyway. Fine, I suppose I can indulge this improv scenario. The lines oh, from... The lines from when... When I ca- when you called me a faker and I took it to call you a faker, right? Yeah. Well, this will be That's cathartic right. to call this you is a be faker and have it be me. All right, then. So far, so good. Hey, that's... A fake hedgehog around here of all places. I found you, faker. Faker? I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Ha! You're not good enough to be my fake! I'll make you eat those words, and also tell you that your inflection isn't quite right. You have to really emphasize the faker. I mean, you, you really <laughs> didn't add enough. These things. You didn't add Don't enough to me, Shadow. To I'm gonna need you to run it again. Oh, come on! Okay, okay. You need to emphasize the faker. I'm clearly showing my superiority in this scenario. You need to emphasize and embody superiority. All right, Mr. Director, I'll redo it. Yes, <laughs> do it again and do it better. Faker, I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. Wrong you're comparing- again. I need more. You are not giving me enough. More. What's happening? Yep. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> they're, yeah, they're doing the line from Sonic Faker, Adventure 2. <laughs> think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Ha! You're not good enough to be my fake. Okay, use the, the cocky attitude. <laughs> be a little more dark, a little more brooding. Reflective. More dark and brooding. More reflective. Okay, more dark, brooding. Faker. I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Ha! You're not good enough to be my fake. Better. Not quite there yet, but better. Oh, come on, Shadow, I'm not you, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna exactly, be you. Exactly, and that's why you'll never get this right. Because I'll show you how to do it right right now. You ready? Faker, I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Ha! You're not even good enough to be my fake. That was okay. That is how it's done. Oh. Yeah, but that's your own line. Of course it's going to sound good. Exactly. And when anyone else does it other than me, they don't do it right. Which because is I'm why not I you, to Shadow, I'm you not and you. teach you the proper way to do it. Why? In other words, you're never going to be good enough to be a fake. Exactly. Dang. He's my fake. I was here before him. Sure you were. He did the Sonic is my you know, Shadow really? Revelation. I mean, technically he was there before you. Well if you go I by mean, the fifty I years thing, stasis for fifty years. If, if you put it like that, then I guess so, but if you exactly. go by franchise, I was there before you. But I was there the whole time. You just didn't know it yet. He's definitely not it's wrong about that. It's like a mystery oh. you didn't know. <laughs> I can't respond to this. So let's oh, do something else, shall we? All right, fine. I suppose we can do something else. What's another improv topic? Throw oh, one at me. Chris, I'll ace it. Three Josh's. Yeah, come on, Angie. Angie, give us something. <laughs> um. Oh my. Oh wait, Chris, you should read Josh's. I love this idea. <laughs> oh my god. Hang on, let me get it up on my other phone so that way I can actually see. Uh, Josh pinged you into the chat. Me. Yeah, I'm about to get to it right now. Hang on. Oh my uh, let's god. See. Yeah, dang phone. One sec. It's alright, Chris. 
All right, here's an improv idea from Josh. Yeah, Sonic tries to get Shadow to wear the the Shadow onesie at the third movie premiere. Hmm. And what gives you that idea? Why would I need to wear a onesie of myself? I'm already me. I am all of me. <laughs> well, Sonic. However, I did hear a little rumor going about that apparently a certain group of heroes is going to go to the movie's premiere wearing shadow onesies. Is yep, that me and Tails and Knuckles. Oh, yeah. We're going to celebrate you, man. We're going to celebrate you in the cinema. As you should. You know, for once, I can say I'm almost proud of you. Almost? Ooh. Wait, almost? Oh. You aren't going full dedication. You need to dye your quills black and red. I'm not going that far, Shadow. Oh, come on. It would be so cool. You'd be the talk of the town. But I don't want to ruin You're the these only quills. one who can move as fast as me. Well, not quite as fast, but s- close enough. If you really dedicated to the bit, then I swear you'd have the fangirls lining up for cosplay photos. Yeah, but I don't want to ruin these you quills. Know. You know, they, they, a lot of work goes into know. this. You I know, think I, Amy might like it. I, what, Amy, oh. don't, don't bring Amy into this. Oh. oh, what's wrong? You don't want to impress your little friend there, Sonic? Well, I don't need to. I mean, she's already impressed to me just standing around eating chili ducks. But think of how much cooler it would be if you dressed up fully as me. Hmm. I mean, I get to have the chest fur. That'd be pretty cool. Exactly. That's probably something that you've been wanting for years. And plus, you yeah. get to have the um, shadow shoes. Exactly. The Whoa. air shoes. I get to wear yes. the air shoes. The air shoes. Yeah. They certainly are awesome. Hmm. <laughs> Air shoes, nice chest fur. Mm. See, it sounds appealing, Ooh. doesn't it? Yeah. It's all coming together. Sound appealing, it sure is. But in order mm. to complete that package, you would have to dye your quills black and red. I'm uh, sorry, but that's just them's the rules. Can't I just, like, you know, do everything else besides the quills? Why not just do take it, the dye that washes out do after it, do a shower? Do it, do it. There's some that wash out after a shower. You could easily do that. But what if it damages my quills? What if I suddenly have, like, you know, different color afterwards? It won't damage your quills. I've done something similar already. You have? Yes. Did you, like, I did. cosplay as Amy or something? No. That Why would I cosplay as Amy? Did. No. No, 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 no. That's not what I did. Oh. Yes, sir. Care to share? Sure, I guess. Remember when Amy and I went to that Hot Honey concert? Oh, yeah. Well, Amy insisted that I dye my quills in a certain color that would match better with the the tone of the concert. So I relented and I, I added streaks. However, I used the kind that would wash out after a shower. And it worked quite well, actually. Yeah. So I can guarantee you that it would be perfectly fine. Okay, if you put it like that, I mean, I guess I could do it. And this is not a a lie trick or scheme, scheme, I promise. Okay, for this one time, I'm going to dress myself as Shadow, and yes, I'm going to dye my quills. Good. Go dedicated to the bit. Become the ultimate cosplayer. Yes, I shall become the ultimate life form. And then I can go around and do my impression of you. Oh my goodness. Oh what is your impression oh of me? I will rate this very critically. I hope you know. Oh no. Yeah, let's, just, let's, let's have a sample. Yeah, you're just going to give it a bad score because you just don't like me sometimes. That's not true. Oh, that's I can be guy. fair that's in right. my okay. rating. Now show me. Okay. Hi, I'm Shadow. I'm one happy hedgehog. Okay, lose the happy oh hedgehog bit, and it's a little bit better. Oh my god. Well, that's the catchphrase we'd love to hear you say, you know? That's not what I say. What I say. Are you trying to mimic me? Are you trying to mimic me? 
Oh, that does it. I, I'm just well, taking no, notes. No, no, no. You fight, make my fight, impression fight, of fight, you, fight, Sonic. Fight, 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 fight. Allow me to give you my impression of you. Uh oh. <laughs> Look at me. I'm Sonic. Yeah, I'm so cocky and fast all the time. I love chili dogs. Oh, yeah. That sounded a lot like silver. That's not silver. <laughs> That's you. That's how you sound like every day. I'm not always that happy, am I? Yes, you are. Almost you obnoxiously are. so. Oh, man. Yeah, sorry, Sonic. Red, I'm you Sonic. Always 100% positive. Oh, yeah. That's you. Every day of every, every waking moment. I can get serious sometimes. Yet you still do it with that same attitude. Well, I like to give people some sort of, um, you know, positive vibes in their life. You know, you can't be sad all the time. I mean, I understand that some people can't help it, but... There's a difference between realism and optimism. Mm. You know, Josh, you're right. I do low-key do a good Sonic impression. I should be a voice actor. In fact, I bet I could be a better voice actor than your current voice actor. I bet I could do the ultimate job. Oh, boy. Imagine the credits of the next Sonic game, starring Shadow the Hedgehog as Sonic the Hedgehog. It wouldn't be so hard to do that. Okay, Okay, Shadow, how would you reimagine Sonic? Well, you see, it's not necessarily about how I would reimagine Sonic, more so what the director would state the director is the one in control of each project and therefore they're the ones who are to give direction on my performance and in order to do the ultimate job i would need to make sure that i adhere to the director's guidelines so it's not up to me how they'd sound it's the director's call that is true okay let me ask you this how would you portray it if you were the director if i was the director i would probably portray sonic as Similar to how he is now, only a bit more serious when it mattered. Yeah, I can be serious. Maybe a little bit less cocky and arrogant in situations where that wouldn't benefit him or his friends. Because don't get me wrong, his... His free-as-the-wind spirit is a good thing. Especially for drawing in potential admirers and followers. I do know that that works, and he does a good job of it. However... In certain situations, being cocky is not the best opportunity. Sometimes yeah, I love action and entry, more though. than just that, and think about his surroundings before things truly get out of control. I, I think about my true. surroundings, I analyze the situation, and then I look for the target and I go for it. I see a cosplayer in front of the booth. Oh, I do indeed. I yep. think that's is that Mitsuri from Demon Slayer. I think it is. Yeah. Yee. Yes, that is quite a good anime. Dragon Slayer and is a good I've anime. And as I've said many times before, anime is a highly respected form of art. It I sure respect is. respect and salute you, Mitsuri cosplayer. You truly have an ultimate cosplay. <laughs> also, we got another improv for you. This time, mm-hmm. from Draco, they asked yeah, you two to uh, compare your cards and their customized parts. Yes, who has the best car, better car in Team Sonic Racing? Oh, clearly oh. me. It's obviously me. Not a doubt in my mind. Sonic? What was the question? Compare the que- your cars. <laughs> How do we compare our cars in Team Sonic Racing and customized parts to see who has the better car? Which, the answer is obviously me. Well, that's quite simple. My, my car is just better. You know, looks nice, has more of a sheen. I shut it quite often. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm not quite sure. Why? Well, you see, my mine has a lot going on under the hood. Yeah, it's okay. You kind of just, you, you know, yours is like mine, but mine's just more colorful. Yours is more dark but and gloomy. The Spark Reaper is a great vehicle. Very versatile. Lots of utility. Great space. It's perfect. Yeah, but I still won the race. You won because you activated your team ultimate. Yeah. That's what you do in a team, like a team thing, you know? It's, it's called My Team Sonic Racing. were not around me. If they were, I could have easily done the same thing and won. Touche! Well, you did kind of left them behind. Yeah. That's yeah. because they were slowing me down. And you see, I'm all about Team Sonic team Racing. You see, I'm, I'm about teamwork. Shadow's kind of like a, uh, what's the word? 
like a lone free ranger kind of guy. Like he does the things by himself. I think the term you're referring to is lone wolf. Lone wolf. Yeah, that's it. Lone wolf. Lone wolf. That's the term. And I can work as a team. I've done it on many occasions. Only because you're forced to. Not because I'm forced to. Do you not remember that whole incident with Neo Metal Sonic? Yes. Exactly. I worked as a team alongside you to make sure that you put that thing in the ground. Mm -hmm. But then for some un unearthly reason you decided to let neo metal sonic turn back into metal sonic and let him go why you do it i will never understand sometimes i like to give people a second chance you know it, I, you give way more I, than second chances what I was is gonna this say you give a second and a third and a fourth and a fifth how many if we're totaling up how many chances you've given how how much is this what are we on like the 25th chance you've given metal sonic well only a few times. Really? Most of the time he gets... I'm not so sure it's a few. Um, you know, I think there's more than that. He gets rebuilt. You know, that's not my, not my fault. Well, you let him go to be rebuilt. That is your fault. Yeah, that it's one time was... Goes. That was... Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times. Well, at that point, you're just asking for it. Hey, I see some hands raised. Oh, All right. right. Uh, I'll call someone up. All right. Uh, let's do Dino Kaiju. Come on up. Hey, Dino. All right. We're back again. Um, Hello, everyone. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome back. Hello there. Yeah. And good to see you again, Shadow. It's been quite a while, actually. Yes, I can't quite recall the last time I appeared on a Revo panel. Though I, I believe last time it's probably either the making shadow laugh panel and then there does there was that one instance that you appeared in the uh in uh silver in uh, blaze's castle uh, during the christmas panel if you guys remember you know that might be the last time yeah Whoa. that is true but you were but saying something last something? significant appearance of me was yes make shadow laugh that whole <laughs> mess i remember that it was fun yeah you were there and tangle and charmy and everyone else <laughs> They all managed to try. I'll give them that. <laughs> all right. So, uh, but yeah, um, so, so Shadow, I'm so certain. So how are, how are things going with you in the panel at the moment? Um, no, not the panel, the, uh, the convention. What do you think? It's very interesting. I see a lot of Star Wars and cosplayers around. Quite interesting. Oh, yeah. I'd love to be there myself, but I'm currently on other business. Business as usual at GON headquarters? Well, GUN's technically been disbanded after Eggman's forces took over the world, but I suppose I'm on my own sort of missions at the moment. Ah, okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, right, 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 right. Okay. All right, so um, I have a question for you, Shadow, if you don't mind. Sure, what is it? All right, so uh, this is going to be curious. So um, ever since um, in you came back after your rehabilitation in sonic heroes um i noticed that once 2005 came around in your game uh you started using you know weapons and all that so that got me curious did you have to take like some kind of training or something when it comes to using weapons like both close range and long range or was it something that you just had to learn right from the spot that's an interesting question and quite in depth i might add well, oh. you see, the weapon changes depending on the utility in the certain situation that it is used. Depending on the situation, I would have pre-presented with a choice. Do I want to take something up close and personal, or would I rather take, take a silent, more long-ranged weapon? That would allow me to, di to have different utility in my taking on of the missions. It's always interesting to go back, especially in that game, and replay those missions with different different sort of techniques to see what the different weapons do. Kind of adds a little bit of variety. As for training, well, I was sort of created with that innate training in me, I suppose. I, I never really recall having much training per se, except in like GUN headquarters. Uh, other than that, it's mainly just came natural. A lot yeah, of I can agree. And, uh, recoil and what type of weapon you're using, what sort of recoil does it have? Um, 
and of course the different types of weapon that you're using whether it be melee long range short range explosive incendiary uh, there's all sorts of different things that you could use really oh yeah for sure like even the ones that they're like vacuums and all that like, like seriously who thinks of a chicken vacuum gun what, what, what? that sounds like something from another sega game mm, sounds familiar oh, yeah. billy hatcher and the giant egg oh yeah that's right it but makes me again, you... how that kid oh. manages to train to be strong enough to control those giant eggs. It's crazy how he does it. It's the power of the chicken suit. So you're saying if we just wear a chicken suit, we could move masses w- with, with like, ease? Yeah, pretty much. I know. Well, mo- well, then you should test that theory. Put on a chicken suit. Try it. I'm curious. What, now? Want me to put yes, a chicken now. suit on do right it. now? No, okay. yeah, do it. Okay. There's no better okay. time than the present. Do it. Okay, I'll, I'll put it on. I'll put it on. Oh, oh, oh dear. Be careful with the chicken suits. There's a KFC guy running around. Oh. All right. Mm, yeah, and he was yeah, sucking the was here. <laughs> you may you want catch to look me out anyway. as well. It is a convention. There may be a Peter Griffin somewhere, and I hear he doesn't like chickens. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, that is true. Oh, God, no. <laughs> I okay, you're right. only looking out for your best interest, Faker. You can't be my rival if Peter Griffin gets to you when you're in a chicken suit. <laughs> well, I'm, I, we'll find out. I'm wearing the chicken suit right now. Oh dear. Oh, yeah. you. Now, uh, <laughs> where do we get an egg? That's a good question. Mm. Anyone have an egg? Have one right here. A big Does one. anybody have a giant egg besides Eggman? Yep. No, I got one right here. It's a big Man. one. Wait, so he is. Can hold it, can hold it. Please. Oh, dear. All right, here Sonic. Go, Sonic. Do, your, here you do go. your thing. Here we go. There you go. No problems. Wow. It Whoa. really yeah. does increase your strength a thousandfold. That's quite interesting. Oh, my God. Of all the things to just... increase your strength, you wouldn't think it would be a suit that ridiculous, oh God, but it's apparently it is. It's Halloween costume. <laughs> Well, I mean, Sonic as Billy Hatcher? I, I don't think that's a bad idea. <laughs> well, you know, Sonic, you could always just use that in your next fight against Eggman. You'd win instantly. Ooh, I should, shouldn't I? That'd be quite cool. Eggman really doesn't have any sort of just te- any sort sure of combat is. against that. He doesn't just have any robot. Just match. tease him with the chicken suit. That's better. <laughs> or better would yet. Would it work? That reminds me. Would it work on chow eggs? Mm. Ooh, oh, I'm back. Think about this, Sonic. Imagine this. You go okay. and face Eggman wearing the chicken suit. Your strength is increased a thousandfold, and you can make egg puns back at him. Oh, to really no. that, oh, that is so true. the Eggman. I mean, honestly, it would be quite hilarious to see. Yeah. Shadow Big Brain. Do you have, a, do you have an egg pun, Sonic? Or? Oh, he has so many uh, egg puns. They like, get annoying a little bit. But some of them are quite good. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a bright time right. for me, Shadow. All right, taking notes just in case. Maybe this will be something for a future panel or something. Maybe like a Sega Star- All Stars panel. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I don't know if we have the legal rights to do that. Yeah, mm, true, I- true. Except for that, <laughs> anyway, uh, he seems to I show up that's... wherever he wants. Yeah, true. I guess. Anyway, so uh, I guess that pretty much answers my question. Uh, thank you so much for the answer, Shadow. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll talk to you guys later. See ya. Hi, Dino. See ya. Thank you. Real. I must say, I do love this chicken suit. It feels quite the warm as well. Yeah, and, and Josh here says I can cluck like a chicken when I face Eggman. That'd be quite fun. Yeah. Oh, boy. I think that would <laughs> be, Come on, Eggman. It would be... <laughs> That's bordering on ridiculousness, but honestly, Eggman is such a ridiculous villain that it fits. Exactly. I can just talk like a chicken to him. I mean, just think about all of the ridiculous mechs and machines he's deployed against us in the past. Yeah. Mm. But I can lift him with my bare hands in this suit. I mean, by the way, it is cold in here. One. Oh, no, I'm sorry, Shane. Yeah, boy. There it's like it's, it's freezing outside, and because we're in an arena, and uh, there's yeah. I'm sorry, no. Shane. Oof. I actually had to bundle up in blankets. There's more hands raised, so oh, no, you it is quite them? cold now in yeah, this. Let's put it up radar. Yeah, let's It was it was quite cold this morning, so I I had a I had a warm lunch. I had a hot bowl of soup. 
It was delicious. Ooh. What kind of what soup was in the it? soup? Uh, it was just a homemade chicken soup. Chicken noodle. Oh, nice. uh, <laughs> and I'm wearing a chicken suit. Uh, <laughs> I guess the theme of this is just going to be not the Sonic and Shadow improv. It's going to be the Sonic and Hello. Shadow chicken appreciation stream. Oh. That sounds <laughs> Hi, quite radar. cool. Hi, everybody. Oh, radar. Hello, radar. Like the chicken hog. Hello. I've returned for hey. another time. Now I'm here with Sonic and Shadow. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you can or is Sonic it that we're here with you? These are the questions we must ask. Ooh, good questions. Mind-blowing. Hey, I'm the one that's supposed to be asking you guys the questions. I, it appears <laughs> that I have played an Uno reverse on you, and therefore I asked you the question. Because I'm... Mm, in- fair enough. Anyway, what is your question? Uh, my, my question is just... Well, uh... Pretty wild stuff that happened with uh, Sonic Prime recently. That whole adventure between the two of you in the Shatterverse is just, mm. uh, it, it it was pretty. It was just pretty wild, and I know some of us liked it a lot. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> anyways, um, I mainly just wanted to ask um, you, uh, Shadow, um, at the end, at the end of. Uh, Sonic and Co's Eggman. Yeah, Whoa, right. Whoa, right. Right. Well, yeah. some people haven't seen the series yet. Well, right. Has not been the one month. It's been a week, but not a month. Whoops. Whoops. Yeah, so be careful, careful there. Yeah, yeah. Don't, don't spoil <laughs> yes. the ending to people who haven't seen it yet. But not that fast. We still have quite a bit of time before the spoiler embargo is lifted. I completely yeah. forgot where we are right now. Well, it's a good thing I have a backup question, because who would you oh, be? The person prepared with the close. backup questions. Thanks for catching through that, me, Shane. Thank you. Sorry, but thank you. No problem. Whew. Wow. Yikes. Okay. Well, then, backup question I have is uh, in uh, from IDW Shadow. Can you can you at least tell me what it was like tapping into? Eggman's giant fake chaos emeralds back at his Eggperial city, because I'm sure it was a whole different power source you had to um, be in contact with compared to you know just regular chaos emeralds and such. And well, I wanted know, to know what exactly that feeling was are. like for you, because you you teleported an entire city into the sky as it was imploding on itself. Yes, well, the chaos emeralds' energies are very different and complex to understand. I mean, the energies of the fake emeralds were wild and sporadic, and it wasn't a more controllable version of what the chaos emeralds are. It took the energy and tried to replicate it in on itself. It just, it was, it was not very easy to control. But once I got the hang of it, I, I managed to, I managed to do it with relative ease, just because of my affinity for using chaos abilities, I suppose. As for what it felt like, it, uh... Imagine you're hopped up on, like, two cans of Red Bull and you're... Ooh. And you're trying to fall asleep. Ooh. That'd be quite challenging. Yeah, exactly. It, it was challenging because it, it made me feel extremely energized. But I was trying to calm myself to manage to use chaos control, but anyway... That, that's kind of what it was like, I suppose. I th- I, I'm not really sure that's the best way to describe it, but it was a lot of energy all at once. As weird as it's going to sound for me, it sounds like as if you were meditating in the middle of a bullfight. Yeah, that's a good analogy. Mm. And hey, Sonic, you're lucky. You know, you said you thought you could try doing chaos control with the emeralds too, but uh, you're kind of lucky you didn't, huh? Yeah. Eh, yeah, can't imagine yeah. what that would have been like for you, because you know you can use chaos powers yourself, as we know yeah. from Adventure Two. But eh, and of course, on Shadow's part, we can thank Silver for helping. Well, Silver did assist. I'll give him that much. <laughs> eh, of course, of course. Well, not sure if any wild things have happened in convention, but I hope things go well for the two of you. Thank you. Please don't say that. We uh, just oh, heard something. Boy. Oh, well, apparently I can. <laughs> what? Mm. 
what else could I spawn in? <laughs> like, I was literally just being told a story that just happened here a few minutes ago. Oh. 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 Well, much like the Sim, has the ability to predict the future, apparently. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Super power right there. I don't have precognition, but if I do, oh. then, uh, uh oh. <laughs> I believe well, the correct uh, word would, as Knuckles would put it, would be, oh no. Oh, oh no. no. <laughs> oh. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well, anyway, thank uh, you. Well, <clears throat> that, do- that does answer my question, though. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. You're welcome. I'll be seeing you guys <laughs> later. See you around. Oh, another <laughs> improv idea. <laughs> I do yeah, love I see it. Well, oh, I love this one. If I can get it up on my phone, that'd be nice. <laughs> All right, I got it. Let's see. Sonic and Shadow building lightsabers. That's building lightsabers. <gasps> yes. Building lightsabers. <laughs> cool. So, Shadow, like my lightsaber? It's got blue. Of course it does. You're so basic. Basic? Oh, come on. Yes. Blue's a cool color, you know? Well, you see, lightsaber colors have a different meaning. Yeah? There's a lot of different colors to pick. You want to pick something that resonates with you. Something that makes sense. I think blue makes sense. Well, hold on a second. I was going to say, Shadow, uh, do you know a bit about lightsabers? I think he does. If he knows Star Wars. He's going to research right now. He's getting his little Star Wars book out. Well, you see, blue... He's, wearing the, he's, he's reading the Star Wars book with his glasses on. <laughs> blue typically, according to the lore here... Blue typically is meant to de- denote places as guardians, showcasing talent in with the Force, people who are skilled with it. Yeah, sounds like me. Meanwhile, uh, green was often wielded by consulars, or deep thinkers, philosophers, people who study the inner workings of the Force, kind of like y- how Yoda does, which is why Yoda has the, the, the green lightsaber, and also Luke Skywalker as well. Red obviously symbolizes power, and it mainly has, you know, it mainly symbolizes tapping into the dark side. Um, mm. And it's not technically something that's made naturally. You have to make a crystal bleed in order to make it red. Ooh. Um, as for me personally, I think that, I think for me, my choice would be this. A purple lightsaber. And a feeling that was coming. Exactly. See, because a purple is meant to balance the red and the blue. The balance between the light and the dark. I can think of no more fitting blade for me. Mm. And it does suit you. Yes. And of course, there's others. There's there's the yellow blade, the orange blade... And then, of course, mm. there's the dark saber, and also white. But we don't have to get into that. I think yours with blue just makes sense because you're you. And then, mine being purple is more more significant. It follows the meaning of the saber rather than just color context. Which I mean, red is a great color, but you have to think about what you have to do to make it, what it stands for, what it symbolizes. And I'm not always just the dark side. I like to think that I'm a bit of a balance. Yeah, you got a soft side. I wouldn't put it that way, but... Come on, Shadow. I know deep down you have like a soft spot. Remix, I will only say one thing. Why? (laughs) Because I can. Well, dang. I do suppose you can. (laughs) That's not me endorsing that you should. Yeah, well, I'm going to keep doing it. Well, exhibit your free spirit. Go for it, I guess. Despite how... Oh, I, I just, I just saw the, uh, the picture now. Oh, yes. Did you just see it? Yeah, I just... Yeah, just now. And what are your thoughts? Well, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's art. It's different. Art is very subjective. Yes, this is true. I mean, Either way, <laughs> I don't even think you would be a good kisser. <laughs> well, you never know, Shadow. Have you kissed anyone before? Uh, no, I don't think so. What but about again, Rouge? I don't think you have either. What about Rouge? Why would I kiss Rouge? 
That sounds and all awful. three of you guys were like a thing. That that sounds awful. No. Everyone knows that Rouge and Knuckles are a thing, not me. Oh. Well, I just thought I mean, because you're the, the way team. Knuckles looks at her. Well, he's usually like focusing on the Master Emerald, so. Did he not in a recent Tales tube tease the fact that he had gotten her flowers? Well, he did, but, you know, I, I thought you and Rouge were a thing as well because you were in the team Dart together and everything. We're co-workers, that's a difference. Yeah, but co-workers get together, you know. Not these co-workers. You don't see me going on a date with Omega, do you? Although that would be rather fun. That would be quite fun to see. Yes. It's like assuming uh, Jet and Wave are going to date. What's that? Yeah. I didn't quite catch that remix. I was saying it's like expecting Jet and Wave to date. I feel like they'd be too busy bickering with one another on how best to lead the Babylon rogues. That is true. That that is true. Always do fight, even with Storm. Hey, should we get someone up? Yeah, sure. some uh, not? raised hands, and we're kind of running out of time. I think. Uh, let's bring up Bolt. Bolt. Yeah, I'm on up, Bolt. Hey, hey, hey! Welcome. All right, I am once again up here again. This time with the Edge Lord. I'm not an edge lord. I'm the ultimate life form, and I'm edgy by choice, I'll have you know. Ah, eh, potato, potato. That's not... Anyway, whatever. What's your question? So I was wondering, um... Well, with the whole... Like, what if you replaced Sonic's role in Sonic Unleashed? If I Ooh. replaced Sonic's role in Sonic Unleashed... Can you imagine Shadow Unleashed? You no, know, it's... It's funny, when I said Unleashed, I thought I heard a distant scream in the ocean. Wait, what? What? I, I didn't hear anything. Something about the wind whispering in the kelp. I don't know. Anyway, um, but I think specifically with Unleashed, it would be interesting to see what those sort of powers would be like, the werehog abilities. It seems mm. like it has an interesting... An interesting ability to make your arms stretchy. Is that what it did? Yeah, it makes you stretchy, strong, and itchy. Yes, that's true. I think that it would be interesting to utilize those powers alongside chaos abilities. I'm not quite sure how they would mix. Be interesting to see, though. Oh, you do have to remember Plus, Dark Eye energy. It's unstable. Plus, it's always a good chance to go and see the world and, you know, experience other cultures, other people. It's... It's very interesting. You try other travel. foods? Yes, lots of good food. I imagine mm. the food in Spagonia was quite good. Oh yeah, it was delicious. Mm -hmm. You did talk about that one place. What was it? Was it Joseph's? You said Joseph's was, was yep, great. Yeah, that's the place. Oh yeah. I really need to go there sometime. It sounds like a good you place. You should. Yes. I imagine the game would probably be called Shadow Unleashed. Yes. But... Which actually works, you know. I actually think that would sound good. It would sound good. Thank you for agreeing. Clearly, it is, it is a good name. Yeah, Shadow Unleashed just sounds quite cool. It sounds so cool, indeed. The coolest, you, know, you say. I, that got me to thinking. Um, here's another what if. I mean, we're talking about what if Shadow was like, you know, the Werehog's Shadow Unleashed, but if we go back to Sonic Unleash, I gotta ask, what Shadow, what were you doing during that time that the world broke up? Actually, that yeah, is a good question. Yeah, what, question. what were you doing? That's a good question. You know, I think, I think I was managing things on a smaller scale with GUN. There was a lot of Gaia monsters that were unleashed upon the world. Sometimes we were tasked out to go and deal with them. Small batches, small groups that were threatening civilians. Uh, there was a lot of different uh, missions infiltrating Eggman's bases, searching for clues about what he was planning next. Uh, just, just that sort of stuff. More, more generic work. More. Sonic was the one who was pretty much taking the lead on taking care of Dark Gaia and and uh oh, yeah. in that instance but we handled more of the smaller scale threats because it was a global scale catastrophe there were a lot of places in need of help so it sure was 
Yeah. Like the area that was hit there by the laser. It's that like were not mentioned in that game or not shown in that game that needed help. I was probably dispatched to some of there, some of those. I don't quite remember everything, but I do remember that I went to quite a lot of places with Rouge and Omega to try and fix the world as well. Mm, that's good to know. Yeah, it's like the blast from the laser was like the power of like 50 atomic bombs. Something like that. It, I mean, it split the world apart. That's a lot. That's a feat that's not easy to do. Yeah. Let alone to think about the for unimaginable you. cost that could cause, especially the effect on the planet itself. Imagine the tides. They were probably going crazy. Hopefully nobody got hurt during those tsunamis. Well, it seems like nobody was really in the main impact zones of the of the cracks in the planet, but anyway. Yes. That's that's yeah, what that I, does answer my question, and of course I will see you guys some other time. See you next time. Have a good one. I uh, I know we're about ready to wrap up here. Hey Shadow, would would you like to promote that upcoming Q and A that's supposed to happen later tonight about your fan film? Oh yes. The Project Shadow fan film. Ooh. Why, that would be a great thing to promote for these last minutes of this panel. Yes, be sure to tune in tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for the Project Shadow fan film Q&A with the director and creator, as well as the English voice actor for myself and mi- the legendary Mike Pollock, who also tuned, who also participated in the project, hosted by, uh, uh, what's, what's his name, is it Kelp or something? I don't know. Anyway, but yes, tune in. It's all about me and my glory and the greatness that is Project Shadow. You should definitely tune in. I approve nice. of this. Nice. <laughs> Until next time, I probably should get back to my mission. I'll see you guys later. Take care, Shadow. Shadow. I'm going to get this uh, chicken suit off now. Well, I'm going to make a move. See you around, everybody. All right. Coming up next, we are going to have Blaze and Silver. Give us a few minutes, guys. Hello, guys. Hey, again. Our next characters should be here shortly. They're still traveling through dimensions. So (laughs) let's give them a few minutes. (laughs) <laughs> oh, child! <laughs> nice. You were having fun there, Shane, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> and I saw a kid. <gasps> I see. Is that a Raven cosplay over there? Oh my god! Yeah, it is. Oh my gosh! Nice. Just gonna give our characters a few more minutes here. They're still traveling. Ah, oh, it's by Silver. Ugh, interdimensional travel is rough. Let me tell you, okay? First off, <laughs> hold me off in the lane. Seriously, that is not right in interdimensional travel. You can really watch your surroundings and pay attention to the other people who are traveling in that lane. You don't just cut someone off. That's rude. Don't do that. Silver, uh, I told you. Please. Hello. Oh, sorry, we've... Sorry, I was just kind of ranting about all the all the interdimensional travel lanes and the shenanigans that that caused. Ugh. Well, if, if we had... Hi, Marine. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Marine? Uh-oh. 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 Marine. Uh-oh. You need to do the trick. You were so excited for this. Why are you so sleepy? I think you need to do the trick, Silver. Let me try to figure out. That trick? Right. Yes. Yeah, I think they got it. I think they took care of it. <laughs> oh, perfect. That's Hello, Shane. Shane. Hi, Hello, Katie. How are? How's the convention? Cold. Okay. Cold. Oh, really? cold right now. Yeah, it's cold over there, and I feel bad. See if that worked. I'm See in a bundle did. of them blankets. Marine, can you speak? Can you hear us? No. Oh, oh no! It was weird. It was just working a moment ago. Hold yeah. on, Marine. We'll help you out. See, first traffic, and now now this. For this. I, I guess that's what happened when Silver made a left turn at Albu- Albuquerque. I told him we needed to ask that somebody. I made a left turn at Albuquerque, okay? Okay, I told I told Silver we needed to ask someone for directions, but he said no. He had it. He had a map. We planned ahead. We knew what we were doing. I just stopped because I needed to go go to the bathroom. Okay. Well, we could have asked a question. Ugh. 
We could have asked for directions at that Look, point. I'm sorry. Interdimensional travel for hours is exhausting. Let me tell you. Oh, let me tell you. You live in this dimension. I don't. Do I really, though? I mean, it, it entirely depends. What dimension I... is Florida in anyway? I don't know. I mean, there's so many stories about Florida, it might as well be its own dimension. You know what? You're right. Exactly. See, I told you. Florida man stories exist for a reason. Let me tell you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Blaze, how are you? It's been a uh, Thank going in the soul dimension. Oh, well, it's been busy. We've wrapped up our winter festival, didn't we, Silver? Yes, we did. That was actually a great success. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that it was turned out really well. That was fun. It was a lot of fun. I had a blast. Oh, me too. Me too. Um, but yes, things are going well. We're starting off the new year on the right foot. Um, hey, what, what, are you, what are you hoping for the soul dimension and the new year? Well, we're trying to work on some new docks and there's some new plans for that. Yeah, and because someone blasted a cannon at it. Again. Yeah, make, you have to make it a certain marine-proof dock. You know, I don't yes. think anything we do will make it marine-proof. I don't think that's ever no. going to be a possibility. Oh, yeah. No, but... Find some creative new way to destroy those docks, let me tell you. <laughs> she is creative, that's for sure. We like to <laughs> encourage creativity, but not when it gets destructive. No, no, I've been having to sort out everything with the naval officers again, uh, but it's fine. I and really think Garden was under a lot of stress because he pulled like four all-nighters trying to get all of the crew together to oh, go and no. fix those talks. I know, I felt so bad for Garden. Poor Garden. <laughs> He's a trooper. He is the best of the best for a reason. Yeah, yeah. that is true. Very true indeed. Press F to pay well, anyway, this, this place you're at seems pretty interesting. It's like yes, a whole I, arena. I don't... I've never been to a convention like this. I've... What? what no way. What You've you never do? been to a convention? What? No, no, uh, okay. no. Like, I've been to summits, like leader summits, but... Oh, those leader are summits are boring. <laughs> well, but These necessary. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta experience the con life. It's so awesome. I went to, to one. Well, it was, it was an imagination of one. But anyway, it was so much fun. Really? What did you do? Well, uh, I mainly uh, put on panels by myself and uh, imagined that there was an audience, also me. And uh, yeah, the the future was currently on fire, but it was it was fun oh. in my head, mm -hmm. in my heart oh, of hearts. Well. I still so, had a great so time. Let me tell you about conventions. At least comic convention. Comic conventions are a lot of fun. You, um, hang on just a second. No problem. It looks like a lot of people are They're so fun. Up. She's at a loss for words. I, I, she must. I told you it was worth it. Yeah, go ahead. Anyway, uh, actually, Katie's going to go and uh, running a bit late. run around at yeah. the convention. You can see oh. it. Neat. Have fun. Bring Please it back. Have a good time. Totally. But imagine a huge room full right. of people who are in different costumes <laughs> of their favorite characters. Really? Oh, wow. So it's like Halloween? Oh, sort, of, sort of sort of like the Harvest <laughs> Festival in your dimension. But uh, yeah, you got all sorts of booths with people selling all sorts of fun things. <clears throat> and then you got, all these different, you got all these different clubs here. Um, these different uh, places yeah, like this. There's a lot of people there. <laughs> Oh, like across wow. the that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. And we've seen oh, a lot of cosplays that people have been wearing so far. Oh, this is this is neat. Uh, yeah, I think I think that's Shadow neat. texted me a picture of like a Demon Slayer cosplayer. Oh, oh. really? Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, they're playing a game. Oh. What game oh, is interesting. that? Interesting. I don't know. Fascinating. <laughs> so um It looks like Marvel versus Capcom. I think it is. Is it Marvel vs. Capcom? It probably sure. is. Oh, I have no idea. But anyway. Oh, hey. Green, hey. Hello. Can, can you hear us? Are we there yet? Yes. Yes, yes we, we are. are. We finally Marine, made, we made it. You were so excited for this. There's Princess Jasmine. Is Princess Jasmine, where? Oh, she just passed by. 
Well, that's Nezuko. Um, Marine, are you all right? Yeah, Marie, Marie you seem sorry, a little... I'm just a little excited. Oh, no, you're fine. Be be excited. It, well, it you're seems... excited, but you're also... You look... Those bags under your eyes. Were you up all night? You slept all the way yeah. here. I'm just a teeny tiny bit excited. I couldn't sleep. Hello again. You know, I feel that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing a live stream right now. Oh, my gosh, there's a real one. Whoa. Uh, that looks like a, a custom R2 unit thing from. Is, the, is it the is is it it Star Batman? Wars? Is that it? Is it? I thought it was Star Trek. Blaze, no, you did Star not just Wars. say that to me. Blaze, <laughs> Blaze, you did not just say that to me. Is that what? No, is it not Star Wars? Not what yes. What is? I, I thought yeah. you said you love Star, yeah, Star Wars. Trek? Star Wars. <laughs> Star Wars is very different from Star Trek. Star Wars wait, is all about wait. action. Star Trek is about You're answering my question. Do nothing. What was your question, Marine? What's Star Wars? I think you'd probably want to ask Ultimate and Kelp. I actually had a yeah, question for they're, you. They're the ultimate goal one nerd. Oh, what? Somebody. What was the question? Someone asked, "What was Star Wars?" Uh, yes, uh, Marine, Marine was as asking what was Star Wars. No, what a Star Wars is. They're Sonic characters. They want ones wanting to know what Star Wars is. Oh, it's I, a movie. I could tell them, but it takes way too long. <laughs> oh, somebody said it was a movie. Mm-hmm. Is it a movie? It's more than just a movie. It's an experience. It is an experience. <laughs> it's a lifestyle. It, like, Let me tell you, it's just so crazy cool. <laughs> oh. I can take your word for granted. Oh, you kind of exaggerate things sometimes. Oh, there, there is Spider Man. Whoa! Yeah, there's we entered the Spider Verse and we didn't even know it. I thought the third movie doesn't come out for a year. Spider Man. Except one of them wearing a hat. That what? was a cowboy Spider Man. Obviously, it was a cowboy, cowboy Spider Man. Spider-Man. Yeah. Spider-Man. I mean, there is the Spider Verse. It could be possible. You know Very what? possible. Yeah, in yeah, fact, can't argue. I love this tour. Thank you, Katie. I've yes, thanks for taking us on a tour things. of this convention. It's so cool. Welcome, it gets me off my butt. <laughs> <laughs> Marine. Yeah, so get to get some exercise. That's always fun. Marine, yeah. you cosplayers. Marine, oh, wow. you didn't yeah. stay up all night Marine was again, super excited you? to see all the cosplays. What? Well, I didn't mean to stay up all night. You stayed up all night again? Oh, Sorry, yeah, we already I'm covered that. Marine, you, you, I, Silver, just tell her, tell her, tell her that she needs to get eight hours of sleep every night. Eight hours of sleep is the goal. Sometimes it doesn't always happen, but it is the goal. You should try to strive for eight hours of sleep. I just couldn't. I was so excited. Oh, well. Well, I understand it. I remember one time I was really excited too, and I didn't hardly get any sleep. Do you want to play a cosplay? Yeah, they're a lot. Yeah, the, wait, how do you know what Demon Slayer is? Oops. <laughs> Marine. Marine, is there something you're not telling us? Hey, there's a dark gathering up ahead. She's not into the theater again, Blaze. <laughs> Marine, Uh-oh. I told you that Let was me guess. not a show She snuck for into you. the theater room in the palace and binge watched Demon Slayer. Is that right? There's. Okay, that's, a and, lot of, and, that's a lot of ghost face. Yeah. Don't tell me you know who Ghostface is, Marine. Well, watch the actual movies, but I saw this film called Scream. Marine! That, that is the movie. It's scary! Marine, you're not supposed to, You're too impressionable for those movies. No, it was so cool! No, I just like not, him. no, they are not cool. Those are very, very rated R! You're not supposed to watch those. Uh, Marine, you probably shouldn't be watching that kind of stuff when you're not ready for it. So I'm pretty, pretty ready. It was ready. radical. No. This movie about serial killers is not radical. You know, radical seems know like something that Sonic would say. I'm not really sure that we should take that line from him. No. Marine. Okay. Okay. You're. Okay. One month, no theater. Oops! You're gonna do that? 
Yes, look, I can. Hey, guys, guys, how about we focus on enjoying the convention and not talk about the grounding right now? We'll talk about that after. You are in oh. so much trouble, Maureen. Blaze, can you just let her enjoy this for a minute? Fine. Yeah, you can You can punish her after the con, Blaze. We'll talk She'll about this when we get home. She'll be grounded for sure after the convention. But okay. let's take a look at this. We will talk about this when we get home. Absolutely. Oh, but since we're on the subject of anime, I did get to watch Sailor Moon Cosmos last night. That was, that was a lot of fun. I enjoyed ah. that. <gasps> oh, oh hey, this is Michael Sonic. Look at that. There we are. Now that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. I guess you could call it way past cool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I did Sonic. <laughs> I see what you did there. Yeah, I'm pretty funny with it. <laughs> Man. So many things to check out. It's kind of crazy, to be honest. This is far bigger than any of the pirate oh, cons I've been to before. That I just saw. That's cool. You've been to... Maureen, you said you've been to conventions? Been to pirate con! R really? Do we you have know, a pirate con? You know, something tells me that probably isn't the best place to go. Ooh, supersonic! A um, pirate. Oh, figures! Oh, God. Oh, I That's didn't awesome. know that you attended. Maybe you, Katie, and Shane can show us around. Show us this, how it works. Ooh. Yeah, maybe sometime. Well, I've never been be to awesome. this convention before, but I'm oh, sure I could work my way around. <laughs> oh, that's, that's a that's a, cool, that's a neat collab. Look at that! Look at that Grogu. I thought it. Well, don't you call it Baby Yoda? No, we do not call it Baby Yoda. Do it's not, not call Baby it Baby Yoda. Yoda. It is not Baby Grogu. Yoda. It's Grogu. 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 Oh, Mike, excuse me. Grogu. Grogu, yes. Grogu. Okay. Oh, look at There's those candies. Oh, gosh. You better keep those candies away from Charmy and uh, Tangle. Mmm. Oh. Look delicious. Can we get some? And possibly, if uh, you behave yourself. I've already bought several okay. kinds. Ooh, that oh, sounds have so you. good. What do you recommend? Can I have some? Mm. Oh, look at those comics. There's so many comics. Yeah, you know, you've been to a convention before. What, like, what's one of the most interesting pieces of merchandise you've seen? Uh, what, uh, you talking to me? Yeah, to you. Well, uh, it was, you know, probably I saw a really interesting, uh, an interesting, like, replica of, like, a prop that was used in a movie. I think it was... Oh, it was Chow in Space 5. Yeah, there was a, Ooh, there was a really one. cool replica of a prop that was used in there. Oh, man. It was going for a crazy amount of rings, though. I, I couldn't I afford know. it. Chow in Space 6 was better. Yeah, that's what a lot of people say. But the cultured crowd likes Chow in Space 5. And if you're really wanting to swing it, you go with Chow in Space 1 and a half. I don't even know I what you're talking about. I can't believe they split that series into quarters. So strange. You know, it's weird that Chow in Space 7 came out before Chow in Space uh, 3, but it's yeah. kind of crazy how that works. Yeah, but it's why, why was that? I don't get it. It's not in chronological order. We're doing our own thing over here. Yeah, they, they, they do their own thing. It, it depends on what the story is. Like, the story really explains a lot of it. Oh, hey, it's look, it's Sonic oh, again. more Sonic. Mm -hmm. Bendy! Oh, oh, I get it. Those are like cereal box covers. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. that's neat. Very clever. I kind of, I kind of, have, a, I kind of have a question for Blaze. It's kind of off top topic, though. Sure. Is that all right, Kevin? Mm. Sure. Mm. What's your question? Uh, Blaze, um, since we're kind of on the subject of events, uh, are there any like other events that you plan to have for the Soul Dimension? Oh, like festivals? Yes. Yes, we have one for each season, so we'll have the Spring Bloom Festival. That's the next one we're preparing for, and then... Oh, um, oh you should see the garden during the Spring Bloom Festival. Mm -hmm. Man, it's oh, crazy. that I want to attend. I will that's bring the, my camera. That's the, that's the ball we hold in the greenhouse. Yeah, it's, it's something else, let me tell you. All the flowers, oh man, it's crazy. There's so many flowers. Oh, there's Sonic again. Mm -hmm. Hey, Sonic's a popular name. He shows up quite a bit. Yeah, I would say Sonic everywhere. Okay, so you have... didn't. Oh, sorry. Oh, go sorry. ahead. Sorry, it's okay. Um, so you have the winter one and the spring one. Uh, mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> There's also the summer <laughs> summer festival. Mm -hmm. oh. Doesn't it come? Doesn't it come around around the sol the solstice, the summer solstice. It or? is. Yes. 
Um, mm-hmm. So we do have our summer solstice, and then we have our harvest festival for fall, and then the winter festival. Oh. And that happens around like around kind of close to Christmas time. Hey, look, those are swords. Whoa, that's cool. I know, I know I've lived at the castle for a little bit now, but mm-hmm. usually I'm on my boat around this time, so I've never actually experienced any of the, any of the holiday festivities. Oh, Marine, well, you, you should come. You should really enjoy yourself here. It is oh, a yeah, little pomp and circumstance, but if you can look past that, it's usually very fun. I, I agree with her. Well, I mean, as long as you and Silver are with me, I'm sure we could have so much fun. I'm sure. You might, uh, unfortunately, I do have to attend royal duties during those times, but I bet you can oh, keep boom. Silver company. I know. I'd rather be with all of you. <laughs> Royal schmoyal, take I it away, know. Blaze. I know they. Marine, you know Blaze's is... speech. Marine, you know Blaze is a princess of the soul dimension, and she has to attend her duties. You know. Uh, what what is it really yeah, like? To attend... Wait, what is it really like to attend royal duties? I'm very curious. Oh, it's just um, pop and circumstance. <laughs> I have to. I have. I have to keep the morale between countries and regions happy. So I'm interacting with dukes and duchesses and giving speeches, holding up royal traditions. Uh, so there's a lot to it. Um, oh, look! It's one, with hoity-toity it's people. We look like moles. Max, oh, Maureen, we don't I'm say. Good. Don't say that, please. We we don't want to upset anyone. And what did she say? No. They're not oh, here, I, are they? No, but we need What'd to. What'd she say? She, she said that uh, I have to interact with all the people that look like moles. Oh, jeez. They all look like moles, I swear. Mm, but, Maureen, don't say that out loud, especially now that you live in the castle. Uh, I mean, to be fair, oh, yeah, she does right. kind of have a point, but so I mean, it's still rude to say that. Well, I think you're just thinking about we... Duke. As long as you can the profile, profile, it should be fine. I think you're just talking about Duke such and such. Oh, excuse me, Duke, what's his name? I think you mean Baron von what's his face? That one. I'm yeah, losing that count. one. Yeah, that is one. he literally a mole? Is he not yes. literally a mole? He is. Uh, he finds a way to weasel his way out of everything. Oh, no. I think it's a part of his character. Yeah, he I does, know. He does. He is our Duke. He handles all of our importation of pineapples. So, pineapples. I thought. Wait, I thought that was that one lady. No, well, she With assists that pineapple him. importation clause. Yeah, she assists him. He he handles the rest. All right, we have a question. Hey, Bolt. Hi, Bolt. Oh. oh, hey. Hello, hello, Bolt. I'm I glad apologize. to see my. Uh... Oh. I'm glad to see Silver, my favorite hedgehog. I actually have a plushie hey, with him. Hey, good me. to see you. Thanks for admitting that. Most people don't like to do that. Yeah, I kind of hate the fact you're so underrated. Exactly. Well, see, Silver it appreciation is, cool. is always accepted. Yeah, but like, I know Shadow guys own game, but seriously, you need your own game. That is true. I know, right? It would be so cool. You know, but, uh, uh, Sega, if you're here, take notes. Uh, according to Sega, there was just a lot of legal mumbo jumbo, so many hoops they had to jump through, and apparently it was just, uh, well, no use. Exactly. It's no use! That's what he says around the castle. <laughs> That's true. I don't say that all the time, I'll have you know. I saw you in the library yesterday. A book hit you, and you went, it's no use! And I like, crumpled to the ground. Hey, that's a force that of weird. habit. You can't blame me for that. It's a force I of habit. I you for that. It's a force of habit to hit your head with a book? No, no, it's not a force of habit to hit myself with a book. It's just that when something hits me, there's it's a force of habit that I'll say it's no use and use my powers to stop whatever's coming at me. Ah. Uh, mm-hmm. Whatever did get, you say, Silva. You know, did we get on, question? on that question, what would your game be like if, if you had to design it, Silva? I'm very well, curious. I imagine it would be a lot. It would kind of be like a puzzle platformer. Wait, I got a great idea for the song intro. Oh, really? What would that be? All hail silver. No, heroes no, rise no, again. not at all. No. <laughs> no, I, I think it would probably have to be some kind of rendition of Dreams of an Absolution or a new song. Or There's a chicken. Is that a chicken? It's Wait. amazing. 
I, I heard Sean oh, wore a chicken suit and made some chicken sound earlier. Really? Did he? Well, that's interesting. Impressive. Look at these costumes. They're immaculate. Man, people take a lot of time to make these costumes. Do you think we could go in costume one time? Uh, yeah, that'd be fun. One of the costumes it yesterday, it was a fully working Iron Patriot oh. outfit. Oh my goodness. Completely wow. in control. Interesting. That's awesome. That sounds like a lot of technical mumbo jumbo. I don't get it. It'd okay, be but... interesting if there was any Sonic cosplayers. Mm. What, Marine? Anyone what dressed as Marine? Dressed I've seen a few little kids dressed up as Sonic. And I, in fact, earlier today, I saw one dressed up as Tails. Oh, oh, that's awesome. Wow, very well yeah, done. And I saw one person with a knuckled backpack. Okay, oh, we well. have another question when, when Kane finishes. Oh. Hey, Dinah. Oh, I found the clowns. I found the clowns. <laughs> oh. oh, gosh. Hello? Uh, that's interesting. Are killer clowns? I, okay. oh. No, I think they're twister clowns. Sorry, Kai, Dino Kaiju, just a second. Okay. Oh, sorry, that's fine. Sorry. Uh, oh, I thought you guys no, no, didn't no, hear me or something. Oh, you're good. All right, Dino Kaiju, what is your question? Thank okay. you for coming. Okay, uh, I was about to say, I hope everything's going well for you three and having fun, at least with this convention, and Blaze, at least, for learning what a con is and all that stuff. So that way yeah. you can at least get an idea how it is. Oh, look at that one. Yes, you taught her. It's amazing. <laughs> Yeah. All on the way to the car ride here. Uh-huh. All right, so <laughs> I actually have a question for the three of you, if you don't mind. Sure. What's three, please. Yeah, for Silvers, Blaze, and Marine. Yeah, sure. I can't wait. Good question. All right, so, all right, so since we are in the topic of, you know, we're talking about these cars. Also, hi, Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just fanboying around seeing all these stuff. <laughs> You're fine. You're right. All right, so uh, since we're talking on the whole topic of cosplays and all that, I'm quite curious to know from the three of you, if you three were to cosplay, what, co what characters would you like to be? Curious to know. I have a counter question. Oh? Together or separate? It might be. Yes. <laughs> either one. Have a book. <laughs> it could okay, be either okay. one, let's yeah. Do, let's do our individual ones first, and then we'll do the group one. I sure, see. that sounds good. All right. Oh, no, you first. Um, hmm. That's a good question. Yo, they're dancing up a storm over there. Oh. <laughs> um, hmm, if I had to say, probably. It'd be interesting to cosplay as one of the knights of the round table. Oh, that's a good Ooh, one. really? Yeah. Now that's interesting. What would which knight would you be? Uh, they, you know, that's that's interesting. Uh, you know, I think Sir one. Galahad, probably. Oh, Ooh, that interesting, interesting choice. Good choice. Yeah, I think Sir Galahad would be interesting. That so you'd be, be a knight, right? Yeah, one of the knights of the round table. And Blaze is a princess. Oh, don't. <laughs> don't go. Blaise I know where you're going. Like don't. Oh, no. <laughs> it's just an observation. I'm, I'm a smart girl. Oh, you are very smart, but please. Not on air. Um. <laughs> I know what you are. Anyway, do you want to okay. hear what I cosplay? What would you sure, cosplay? Go ahead. Right I'd do Luffy from One Piece. Oh, that would be oh, perfect for perfect you. Perfect yeah, how fitting, how fitting. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are we talking pre-time skip or post-time skip? Pre, pre, I want to be in the beginning. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Interesting. I assume gotta you already got a new adventure from the beginning. Nice. That'd be interesting. All we need now is a straw hat. That's perfect for you. Maybe oh, we yeah. could get a straw hat. It's possible. Oh, yeah. And a replica of the gum gum fruit. What would you cosplay, Blaze? Oh, I don't know. I, I'm i definitely less acquainted with pop culture. Um, oh, gosh. I feel like Princess Peach would be something for you, Blaze. Oh, really? Yeah. Maybe. Either her or Mulan, because I'm kind of mixed between two. Fire character, but there's so many. Either, I feel like either, Rosalina I, would be a better choice for Blaze. 
Oh, either that's perfect, are, actually. Either those two or Mulan, because I'm kind of mixed with those three. I do see a lot of people associating me with Jasmine, so maybe that could work. Oh, you'd be so that pretty. Could work. Oh, oh, probably hey, yeah. pretty stand-up Aladdin. Oh, would you be Aladdin? Yeah, <laughs> why, why, why wouldn't I be Aladdin? Oh, <gasps> no reason. I have the best idea ever. What's your idea? What's your idea? What if I be the tiger? I was about to be the tiger. Oh my goodness. Me. Okay. Okay. in the audience. But then gaps, make it happen since you're here. <laughs> that would be hilarious. The real question is who would be a boo? Oh, oh, that is a could, good question. I would actually. be the fiercest protector of the princess. Maybe garden. Maybe garden. Maybe. Oh, I garden don't know if you would boo? be up for that. Oh. Actually, <laughs> maybe the actually, sultan. More importantly, the sultan. Oh, I don't know. Actually, I was about to ask who's going to be the genie. Oh, Sonic for sure. Mm, He's Sonic. Blue. <laughs> He's blue. Oh my god! And he has the genie's personality, so I can see it. Oh my god, I can already imagine Sonic singing Never Had a Friend Like Me, uh, guys? <laughs> uh, guys? Yes. Yes. That Sonic what? would be Look who's down there. I don't know. Absolutely not. Oh, Sonic! Like, you, you, oh, you, you, you would be the genie, oh, or what? If, uh, that's what uh, you would be. Dr. Star, I didn't see that you were coming. Hello. <laughs> when hey. did you get here? What are you doing, Doc? I have uh, no idea you were coming. Yeah. Uh, no one oh, did. I didn't no. even know myself. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey. Hey. You know I'm Dr. Starline. Go, Dr. Starline. Go, in the back end. Go, in the back Sometimes the best plans, my dear Kevin, are the plans you just come up with uh, on the fly. Uh, you know, that is true. You just try to pun? No. Uh, uh, hold on, hold on, Blaze, Blaze, Blaze. What is it, Marine? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hide. Behind oh, it's it's all it's all right. legs. Dr. Starlane actually uh, works for me. He's one of our scientists at the. <clears throat> yes, yes, I do. I am. He's a he's not going to do happy. anything, right? I still oh. don't know why you employ no, him after not, the whole metal right virus there. incident. Well, Miles told me about the things he's done. He's scary. And, uh, what have I done, little one? Well, you literally caused a virus that almost wiped us all out. Absolutely not! That was all Dr. Eggman's work. I just you say, happened you to say be that, there. but I have got on record and told you why you caused it, and yet you still deny it, even though it's undeniably true that you helped. Well, I, it's true, I did help, but I wasn't the root exactly. cause of it. Exactly. So it was therefore, a plan by that proxy, Dr. you Egg, helped cause it, it and was by a... proxy, again, you are also guilty. My word, you're almost guys, as bad as the internet. Let me finish, guys, please. Please don't fight in the con. We're trying to have fun. Yeah, yeah we're trying uh, to have fun. Later, uh, uh, but before, before they argue, Radar, I have a question. Hello. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh. Oh, I, oh, I, mean, I, don't really know. I thought you were oh, a my fat. Goodness. Oh, my goodness. I love very dark. What is your question? I was trying to type something out in the chat, and uh, I the uh, the thing to uh, bring me up on stage. It like oh, sorry, it, we didn't mean to interrupt you. Sorry. Oh my gosh! I I. <laughs> I'm Do you so need sorry. A moment? I was trying to type something in chat, and then I joined, and I didn't even realize I was in the stage to be. Wow. <laughs> you want to go right? You'll make mistakes. Mm. Magic. Yes. <laughs> even the great Captain Marine. Would you? Yeah, like do you the one time where you broke the dock. Uh, I have no recollection of that. There's still I have records of that, it. including on the accountants, the amount of uh, wood you had to Look, use to repair the ship. Snow cannons call when snow cannons call. Yes. Can you hear I me? Yes, yeah. Shane. Hello. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, sorry. Uh, sometimes I my mic likes to cut out, and I just want to make anyway, sure. Anyway, do you want to ask your question, Rita? <laughs> my yeah. dear Shane. How lovely it is to hear your voice once more. Hi, Starline. That gives me the creeps. You can stay with me, Marina. Right. I assure you he's safe. Starline. Right. Uh, yeah. What was your question, by the way? Uh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, answer your question. Oh, you guys can go ahead and uh, speak if you need to. Um, you know, continue, oh, okay. continue the conversation. Um, 
I just need a little bit, like just a second to like, yeah, you know, no how right. am I going to ask this question? Like, I know what my question of is. Course. I just need to like word it. You, better. You're not, no you're, problem. Okay. No. Okay. I, I actually got a question from, from Maureen. Uh, what was your, what was, which vehicle did you like the most in Sonic Rush Adventure? There were several of them. Maureen? Uh-oh. Sorry, repeat the question. Sorry. What vehicle did you like the most in Sonic Rush Adventure? What vehicle? Yeah, like there, there was like the water bike and the submarine and the, and the sailboat and, and all that. Hmm, none of them, because none of them were my ship. My ship is supreme. Y- Fair enough. Ship is point. Supreme. It's like Jack Sparrow Love with a black my fair maiden. Wait, is your ship named Supreme or Fair Maiden? Please make up your mind. Because I have several names listed on this. Every time you committed a crime, you would change the name of the ship. Well, we could change the disguise every time you do a crime, right? Like in the movies. Life's not like a movie. Me ship gets a change of name, too. Ah. Yes. No. Oh, doctor. Uh, oh, go ahead, Shane. Did I, I, I swear you guys have been uh, trying to buy stuff on our table all day today. Oh, no problem. Ooh, what you say? Well, what doctor, are you saying? Just, oh, I'm sorry. My, my apologies, Miss Blake. No, no, please. Go first. It was... Rude of me to interrupt and intrude, please. Uh, I just wanted to see how, uh, how's that Fix6 project going? I know that you have been working on it quite a bit. Ah, yes, well, it's, um, can't say much here, but, uh, it's going well. We hit a bit of a roadblock about a few weeks back, but I've, using my superior charm and intellect, I've managed to figure out a Charm is debatable. Silver. I have plenty of charm, more than you, tough guy. Silver, he does work for me. Please let us be professional. <laughs> yes, professional. I can be professional, <laughs> although I still will suggest that this is a bad idea. Well, I guess I was just hmm, wanting to well, no, 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 be no, no, more no. trustful. It, it's all right, you. Mr. Princess. Allow me to talk to him for it's a minute. It's okay, Blaze. I trust you. No, no, don't. We don't need to talk. We're here to enjoy this convention, not fight. So let's do that. Yeah, uh, I believe. Sentimental, you know. Yeah, I, be- I believe Radar has his question ready now. All Excellent. right, Hold bring on. him up. Hey, Radar. Yeah, yeah, I do have my question. Yeah, cool. Yeah, uh, it is uh, mainly for uh, Blaze and Silver. Of course. Oh, oh I mean, no. boo! Oh. oh. Well, I do have something to say to you, Marine, but I just need to. Uh, uh, oh. I I do have something to say, not ask a question. I have something to say to you, but I do want to ask this question to Blaze and Silver first. What's hey, your okay. Don't Thanks. worry, it's all right. To be fair, I had no idea Starline was showing up. Anyways, um, apologies, no, Doctor. No, it's all right. <laughs> mm. Well, uh, first and foremost, Blaze Silver, been yes. hearing that you two have uh, been recently exploring a lot of Sonic's world. Um, yes. You guys, uh, hearing that you guys went and visited uh, Soliana and Missouri recently, and I wanted to simply ask, is there more of Sonic's world that you guys would like to explore? Is there more zones and continents and such places that you guys are interested in seeing that you haven't before? Oh, good question. That is a good question. We did talk um, about revisiting Green Hill. Well, Green Hill is Green Hill. It's great and all, but if I had to pick, you know, I think I'd probably go with... Huh, what, what is it? What is it? I'm blanking on the name Are of... We, the- well, we did talk about going to the Emerald Coast Resort. Well, yeah, but... Wait, have you two seen Tonic and Tails' new house? Uh, no, not yet. Oh, you gotta see it. It's really nice. I went over there, and I broke a vase. Maureen, you, you did it. No, please tell me you didn't. Oh, that's right. It was out of it. the aftermath, but I felt my that's tail right. hit something, and then something smashed, and I ran away. You ran didn't away? Didn't you also break a window? No, uh, who can say, really? Yes, to answer, to answer your question, uh, for me, it would be Adabat. Oh, 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 that's a good one, Silver. I know, uh, right? I haven't been there yet, but it, like the tropical vibe of it is just so cool. And I hear the sunsets are breathtaking. Silver loves nature. I do. <laughs> it's why he Guilty takes care charge. of the victory garden so well. He does. Considering his history, I don't. 
I, I, yeah, it makes sense. He, he would like nature. You really want to talk about history, Starline? Let's not even. Um, so, Silver, what were you saying? I was just saying that Adabat's my choice. Adabat? I, I think we can work that into our plans. Yeah, absolutely. I'd love to go there sometime. Mm. Where is that? Oh, it's, uh, it's kind of in like the, the southeast of Sonic's world. It's, it's like a tropical slash jungle, like, paradise. It's, it's beautiful. Really cool. I've been. From what Do Sonic- they sail ships there? Oh, yeah, they sail ships all the time. Yes, Serene, what? The biggest we gotta go. Ever seen. They have all these amazing, like, merchant boats there. And it's like, you know, yeah, they sell like, off their produce pretty, there. Pretty, you'd pretty neat stuff. No, it's like a market? Kind of. Nuggets, yes. That's so cool. Yeah, I think I think Marine would really like it. We should totally go. I'm all for it. Well, I, I'm sure can you'll we blaze, can we? your best behavior, Marine. Oh, can we blaze? Can we? Well, we still need to talk about you staying up all night and using the theater. And it sounds like is that where you were when we when you were grounded at the Fine. palace? You were at Tails's house. I, uh, uh, t- who, who told you? <coughs> Your father has to work to do the pre-order. Oh, so that's how Tails' computer like, got the oh. Apple boot up sound. <laughs> I I don't get the blame this time. Well, Marine outfit. To be honest, I don't favor those. Well, Marine, we'll yeah, talk everyone when knows we get that back. Tails likes bananas more than apples. To be I mean, honest, Blaze. I'm sorry, Marine. Go ahead. Can I be honest, Blaze? What? I wanted to add house evasion, house arrest evasion to my list of crimes. Like a resume. Good night. That's She's got more really of a, a list resume than I you do. You want to have. Mine's pretty long. <sighs> Marine, we talk. Big crimes like yours, it's little ones. House Marine? arrest evasion? Do you know the punishment of evasion of house arrest? It's no. not pretty, let me tell you. Oh, and why do you know it, Starline? Because I Could you have the judicial system? Crime? No, I've never been arrested. Have, I've never been in house arrest before. Thank you very much. Or are you Thank sure you. about I that? Say, I think it works a little yes. differently in the soul dimension. Because Blaze is the one who put me under house arrest, so wouldn't Blaze decide the punishment? Oh, wait, how, did that, how did that work, <laughs> Blaze? I'm very curious. Oh. No, 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 no. Evasion. You said evasion of house arrest. Evasion. That's she worse traveled, than actually. She traveled to Sonic's dimension when she was under house arrest at the palace. Come to find out. Oh, oh, I, we will talk about this after the convention, won't oh, we, Silver? Yes. Yes, we will. Oh, no. I, I forgot to mention, I actually have been under arrest before for a crime I didn't commit. Oh, yeah. Are you sure about that? No, no, he was definitely innocent this time. Yes. Uh, Serge and Kit framed him. Wait, yes. how does house arrest work in the soul dimension? It's probably oh, just this. Uh, sorry, Shane, go ahead. I'm sorry, uh, Sneaker just came over here. Oh, oh the okay. droid's name is Sneaker. Cool. Hello, Sneaker. Oh, my hey, goodness. Sneaker. That's an astromech. Hi. That's a great aim, and you're a great droid. So this is... Star Wars, not Star Trek. Yes. Or Star yes. Line, Star Wars, blaming. not Star Trek. If you say Star Trek, that'll hurt his feelings. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, it has a little arm. How cute. Yeah, that, that's, that's what he uses to plug into computers. They're adorable. Oh. <laughs> I just want to give him a hug. Oh. I want, he kind of looks Can like a seed on one, it. I want a hundred of these working for me. I need this. I, this Star is line, you don't deserve a hundred of these working for you. Can I have one? So they, they kind of, they kind of remind me of a sea barnacle. They do look like a sea barnacle. Know, yeah. Coloration well, they're wise, sea barnacle. They're the cutest sea barnacle I've ever seen. <laughs> maybe we should get you one. My mouth. Yes. <laughs> Please uh, do. Well, your birthday is well, ten months away. So maybe we can get something arranged. Oh, really? Something to look forward to. Yeah. What kind of dro- droid? Is that what it's called? Droid? Robot? Yes. Droid. It's a droid from Star Wars. 
Not Star Trek. Okay. Are they like I'm badniks? Uh, no, 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 they're not no. like badniks. Hmm. Bad they, don't, they don't have an animal inside of them. Okay. What do they have running them then? Just machinery. Uh, weird. But they have the ability to kind of develop their own personality as they kind of are used more. And then the longer they're around, the more they learn. And they, they honestly become like their own person. I wonder who that reminds me of. Yeah, it kind of, kind of reminds me of Omega. Oh, oh yes, Omega, yes. <laughs> yes, yes, correct. Uh, I, what were you exactly alluding was, to, Starline? Is, Oh, no, no, I was thinking of Omega, too. That's right. He, sure the, 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 you the were. Uh -huh, and Metal sure. Sonic was, is also another perfect example. Which one? Base Meta. Metal, I suppose. Ah, well, nah, I wouldn't say Metal Sonic. He doesn't really have his own personality. Listen, he just, doesn't just because he's one. mute and doesn't talk doesn't mean he has his own personality. What do you mean? He's talked on our panels. Oh. Right. I forgot what are you on about? New, uh, yeah, you're, you're having Star selective Lines memory getting a little here, crazy Starline. I've been gone for a while, all right? Let me be. Is this what they call dementia? It possibly. Mm -hmm. I think you should this ask not Shadow. Dementia. Uh, what are you talking about? I am completely fine. I think you should ask Shadow. Know. He might have a case of amnesia, and Shadow could clear it up. If I had amnesia, I would not be able to remember, but I did because you reminded me. Um, well, who's the one it. with the doctorate here, Silver? You or me? You don't have a doctorate. Then why is my name Dr. Starline? Because you took the name Doctor to impress Dr. Eggman? That is not true. Yes, it, it is, and you know it's it. It's on his resume. Yeah, yes, I, I attended several schools. Oh, really? Very which schools? prestigious Tell schools. Me, right no, here, no. right now. Tell me which Harvard one. was one. Harvard was oh, the first. Oh, oh challenge, challenge Starline. <laughs> Was the um, William and Mary is another one. And, oh, it was a third one. It's the one in Station Square. It was named after a really famous person. Um, the name escapes me, but that's where I received my master's degree, actually, in robotics and psychology. Giuseppe's? Yes, that's the one. What, Giuseppe's what? is an Italian restaurant, you idiot. Yeah, I just realized... It was like, <sighs> see what I mean? Well done, well done, very clever, you rotten. Doctor Starline, kind of suspicious. Doctor Starline earned Extremely. his doctorate in physics. Anyway, we're getting ahead of ourselves. Station Square skull. University. Thank you. I examined How his resume you know that thoroughly. He doesn't. Yes, see, I, I, I've been through so many. I've been to so many colleges and been everywhere. I, they all get kind of jumbled up. Marine, I, I think Blaze might have been brainwashed by him slightly. I Silver. did no such thing. She would so, burn me. Should we have a conversation, Silver? How come she knows his university name, but he doesn't? Suspicious. It's either he brainwashed her, or uh, he's just an idiot. We gotta save her. I've been mm. trying. I'm right here, you know. Shh, we're not talking uh, to you. Let's go look at the Legos. Oh, and, oh. and Marine, uh, Marine uh, Radar Shadow, uh, he was going to say, how could you say that on Tailed Vessel when he, when he left the ones he created except for, for the SS Tornado EX at, at Southern Island? You, you captained the Ocean Tornado the, the last time we saw you. That's from Radar. Wait, can you repeat the question? Oh, uh, Radar was saying, and an Radar was statement to you is that, and also Marine, I was going to say, how could you, how could you say that on Tail Vessel when he left the ones he he created, except for the SS Tornado EX at Southern Island? You captained the the Ocean Tornado the last time we saw you. I'm going to be honest. That was so long ago that I have no idea what you're talking about. She's kind of. Gone to her own sort of ships. You know, Silver and Starline, Dr. Starline, looks like Gabsam yeah. has some interesting pic depictions of you both. Star. Oh no, what atrocity in meme format have I committed this time? She always draws meme pictures of us because we're oh, funny. Oh, the dress one. Ah, that's a good one. I think <laughs> I would wear it better, though. In your dreams. 
Oh, really? Everyone knows I could rock that look so much better than you. Uh, no, in my younger years, I used to model, model. I was the finest male model that in your ever younger down. years. What does that mean? How old even are you? Well, they haven't said, this but I believe I'm in my late twenties. Maybe. Are you just secretly some kind of old man? No. <laughs> You're saying your younger years, like you're like you're educated and you're some older guy. Like when I was in like my in your... early teens, pre-teens, I used to model. You, Starline, you look like you're in your mid to late twenties. What do you mean younger years? Were you like five? <laughs> look, 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 look. You can do a lot in in to in twenty years. Okay, you've done a lot in your in your fifteen, fourteen, however old you are. Huh? You've saved the world countless times. Mm -hmm. Exactly. You've done a lot. But I'm not the one calling You're myself. You're technically 200 my years older years. than the rest of us. Technically, he's 200 years younger than the rest of us. No, he's from the future. Yeah, so yeah, that's true. That's what that's I was right. saying. Yeah, uh, if hello? we math correctly, I'm 200 years younger than you. So you are an old man, Silver. <laughs> please, please, he is one of my employees. Please res treat him with respect. <sighs> Fine, respect. but only because Hooligans. he's an employee, not because <laughs> I like him. I don't. Respect. <laughs> uh, I apologize, Blaze, but hooligans like him do not understand the concept well, I would... of respect. Hooligan? No, excuse Hold on. Okay, Dr. Starline, Silver is my friend, and as an employee, I would ask you to also give him respect. <sighs> Very well. That's the least I can do. you want a hooligan, go find <laughs> Fang the Hunter. Well, then that'd be funny, because he'd have to change his name to Fang the Hunted. Oh. I got a snort! I, mean, yeah, I got true. a snort! That was funny! I got a snort! I'm taking that. That's a victory for me. <laughs> <laughs> that was a I'll snort. I'll tell you, that's I, one I of your better laugh. jokes. Still didn't make me laugh, but it was a better joke. Wait, oh, I wasn't trying to make you say laugh. children are brutally honest, right? That yes. is true. Yes. I don't like You're not going. funny, Dr. Starline. You're kind of oh. sad. Maureen... Hmm. <laughs> now that's funny. Well, maybe I just need to hang out with my wards, and maybe I'll pick up a few dad jokes or two. Oh, geez, don't, don't, don't remind me. That's right. You do have children, right? Not exactly. They're my wards. I just They're happen to be the wards, legal guardian. As in, you, uh -oh. you are like a father figure to them, as bad of an idea as that is. Well, yes. <laughs> Really? Because the last time I remember, they were trying to frame you. Well, you see, we're having issues, fam familial issues. Uh huh. Um, issues. Sure. Yes. Yes. Uh -oh. yes. It's yes. But um, I think I'm great with kids. <laughs> now that's great a funny with kids. joke. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Well, if they'd give me a chance, I'd show. But of course, I'm automatically ooh a bad guy. <laughs> I've done five things that makes me ooh. But um, of course, no one knows. Uh, no one understands the concept of second chances. Sonic barely grasps it. Are you sure Sonic barely grasps it? What chance is Metal on? Like twenty-five now? Hmm. He does make a point. I mean, he, he does have you there. Well, but see, that's why he's employed with me. He's mm. getting a second chance. He's in an entirely different dimension. Yes, that is true. That is true. That is very true. But I could be convinced to build, perhaps, a ship. A, a ship? Huh? A big ship. Ever heard of a, yeah, a man of war? I think you no, put the marine. I, I think you're that's out of your jurisdiction, Starline. You it wouldn't be any problem. Kind of phony. Phony. No. no, these are military ships made of wood. They're the hardest. They have the hardest wood. They've got. We've like, got. Four. It looks like we're running out of time. We've got only like four minutes left. Yeah. Was, was there anything we wanted to say before we wrap wrap this up? It does look like Gabs has a question. Perhaps we can answer that I'll, one. I'll, I'll read one of them if you want. Oh, yeah, them. yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, there's she has she has like three, so I'll I'll just read one of them. Just Sorry, some Gabs. Of them. Yeah. <laughs> she uh, Blaze. I think this one's for you. Uh, okay. Blaze. What plans do you have with Starline? Well, Starline is in our science department. He's handling a lot of the physics with 
Interdimensional really? travel, yes. With interdimensional travel, we have to really plan ahead with that. Um, oh, so see. he is in that department. And let me tell you, it's hard work. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Can you tell the guy who I was driving next to to not cut me off next time? Silver, that, if you follow Wait a minute, that was you? Uh-oh. You're the one who cut me off? Ah, uh, well, I was in a... Uh, in a hurry. Uh, I, I this was a clicking into place. It's an excuse. I was in a, I was going to be late. You know how important it is to be on time. Well, you already were late. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Ouch. <laughs> got you there. You say? I got fifty. Well, I wasn't late yeah. to this. I was late to an, 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 another another oh, another thing. Yeah, yeah no. What appointment do you have? My phone died. Oh. Oops. The phone died. But, but, but yes, yes. Um, <clears throat> move on. Next question, please, quickly. I guess, I guess it's time for us to wrap up. Yeah. 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 Uh, but yeah, what, what, was there anything you all wanted to say? Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Andy. No, no wait, we got to go already? Yeah. Yes, and, and, and you, Missy, need some sleep. Look at those bags under your eyes. Sleep. Oh, but it felt so quick. Yeah, yeah well, always oh. next time. But anyway, what, what what all would you like to say before we wrap this up? Well, uh, uh, thanks for tuning in. I'm glad I got to check out this convention. It seemed like a lot of fun. I wish I could have been there, but uh, like I, I, like in person, not a disembodied voice. But uh, yeah. Also, to the guy who cut me off, who may or may not be in this room, uh, I wish you have a terrible day. <laughs> he probably deserves it. Oh, no. Yeah, most likely. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'd stay longer, but it's no use. All right. Marina, mm-hmm. how about you go? Can we come back to this place next year? Yes, yes, we can. Uh, maybe after we talk about your violation of house arrest and you watching things you shouldn't be. You forgot about that. <laughs> mm, you won't I'm forget. Gonna, I'm just gonna... Silva! Uh, t- t- Marine... <laughs> Hide behind you. <laughs> Please scares me. Look, look, I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to accept a punishment for this. You you gotta follow the rules, okay? Oh man. Alright, well, I think we got that covered. Mm-hmm. We'll see you later, everyone. Have a great Comic Con. Uh, wait a minute, what about me? Yeah, go ahead, Dr. Starline. Uh, can we leave already? <sighs> <clears throat> I apologize for arriving late. I did not realize I would be here. However, I immensely enjoyed my time and meeting all these wonderful people. I truly wish I was there at the con to see everyone. I do believe I would accidentally steal the show, but that's just who I am. And it was a pleasure meeting you for the first time, Marine. I'm sure my being here and working underneath your fair princess will be the start of a wonderful, beautiful partnership. Please hold my hand. Uh, On that note, uh, Marina, I think it is time to go. Um, Thank you for having us and have a great con. Good good afternoon, everyone. Bye. 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 Goodbye.